crab. I was, I was, I was like, I can't. I'm not going to do this. I'm not going to I refuse. I'm not going to do it this I time. Feel, I can't. I feel incredibly <laughs> bad for all of the viewers because that was just an explosion of sound immediately. <laughs> there was no fade in. It was just boom. Like, <laughs> Oh. I, you know what I love seeing, which is Look not at true. Pip's picture. I see, yeah. Uh, my computer is just like, or my, Zoom is just like, your internet connection is unstable. Like, bitch, I have 150, 150. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, everybody? Welcome to Neon Scream. Hello. Yeah. Oh. Welcome, welcome. How's it going, everybody? Welcome to the show. If you've never seen the show before, we do the Sprawl RPG, some cyberpunk uh, some cyberpunk role playing here, and uh, it's a lot of shenanigans and me killing people, and it's it's the best. It's good stuff. It's good stuff. I hope everybody's excited to scream tonight. Um, <laughs> maybe can we honk? Can we honk instead of scream? Yeah. I don't know. If, I, I don't honk. know if it's possible for goobers or Mav to do that, but. <laughs> <laughs> hey. There you go, Black. Hey. Hey. Wow. There you go. Actually, I gotta practice honking. It took so me. I can just honk at people to get out of my way. I gotta to practice my <laughs> honking. <That's what> <laughs> beep, beep, beep. You have to get you out of the way. Just... <laughs> beep, 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 beep. You should uh, place bets. Oh Mav, my. you should place bets like and run a counter if you get bored tomorrow, like that you inevitably will. Um, <laughs> place bets beforehand for like horrible shit you're gonna see. Just like make a list Please. and make a counter and just get like a, get a rave bingo, <laughs> a rave bingo. Oh yeah, <laughs> everybody it has to exist. Mav Please. is going really to a rave like, tomorrow, so she's going to, to die. Them. And then I'll, I'll just post pictures in my Insta stories of like check. Yes, <laughs> like, like uh, looking like she's gonna pass out from heat and fur. Wait, are you talking about are you talking about EDC? Yeah. Yeah. So so uh girl with flower crown. Yep. Um, wasn't that Burning Man? Just yeah, bare nips. Everything. Same, same uh, thing. Just um, <laughs> same thing. Uh Pacey's then you have off. then you have guy with <laughs> bottle of mystery paper. You'll bottle see that. Bottle of mystery paper? Not like like tiny little tiny little clear bottles with little pieces of paper. Yep. You yep. think? Yes. Oh yeah. Absolutely. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> oh. Know. I like. I like. Just clued in. It was drugs. I was like, why the fuck would anyone carry <laughs> yeah, paper yeah. around? What the fuck? Why don't you just carry around? <laughs> just carry your drugs in your fucking wallet, you idiot! Like, what? What do you have it in a water bottle? That's, that's too simple. What the fuck? It's got to be in uh, a crystal, it's, rose it's quartz you can get crystal. rid of it really quick if you need to. <laughs> I, I guess so, yeah. Tiny. Welcome to Seattle. I'm, I'm right. so glad I'm too old for that shit. Oh I really am. That's, I was uh, always too old for it. The Thank mental you. picture for everything, just it, I, like, immediately can't handle I it. Can do, yeah. I can do, like, a day of it and just, like, no. I get drunk enough and be fine. But then after a day, I would do a festival for, like, like, a, like four days once, and I will never do that again. That's just too much stupid. That's no. too much stupid. People think though. I'm, that's what I think when I'm at the Dude, worst time with. But yeah. Remember Pax East smell multiplied nope, by go. like a thousand. Mm. <laughs> you just I... feel like for a few and just support people. <laughs> you walk back. I'm just gonna pray pure on everyone. I'm like, oh, I'm just wet. <laughs> you need to go with like a hazmat suit. He's like, <laughs> but it's just like this big uh, bubble suit. The party oh, can start oh, now. Oh. <laughs> if you went, if you went in a hazmat suit and tricked it out with LS or like L L L C D L E D bolts, L S D L E D both L S D and L C D S, you know you would be the coolest. You would, you would. Uh, also, beach balls, any kind of beach balls, you'll see yeah. some of those. <laughs> Yeah, uh, and then actually, you know what? Let's let's make it a little harder. Deflated beach balls, because you're gonna see that. That's for sure. <laughs> Nobody can just have fun. Uh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Stop it. That would be a hilarious pasty. A beach ball. A pasty. Be 
<laughs> no, I was just imagining like full deflated beast beach balls. Yes, yes. Like, just, right. just cut open at one end. And just there you go. You're good. <laughs> Mab's making the bingo card already. It's I'm fine. already making them right. Uh, yeah. Uh, multiple <laughs> people <laughs> making out. That's gonna just happen. I mean, yeah. that's just. A, but I mean, bingo. Yeah. If you you need some easy you gotta, ones for bingo, you have to. There's gonna be one couple fucking. Like there's going yeah. to be one. Yep. That's yep. got to be the middle one, that's like the right. Yeah, that's that's the, the center <laughs> because it's gonna be like there's only gonna be like three people that do it the whole event, <laughs> and you have to find are them like at the concert. Oh, maybe it's Vegas. Yeah, it's maybe. dark. Yeah, and it's yeah, yeah dude. Room. Depends you on me? how much Molly there is. <laughs> I, mean, <laughs> I mean, it's Seattle. <laughs> it's a rave. That's what I mean. It's, it's Seattle. Seattle. Yeah. <laughs> there is a possibility. I might Don't. be high just by being in the room. Count. I want you to count. Or keep track of how many EMTs you see the entire night, like come <laughs> in and fucking out, dude. That's a good one. Oh, Ten man. and more, you get to mark off the space. Yeah, like, like we said, carry around those fucking one oh. gallon things and just hand them out to people. Uh, uh, way too obnoxiously loud about being fucked up on some drugs, girl. Oh my god! Oh my god! So god this is up. so great. <laughs> That so, one. So you know, it's like five of those. Man. That was just two of them, and I almost died. So, yeah. so like a yeah. hundred of them. Yes. <laughs> like I wanted to die there. That was terrible. It's gonna be a great time. <laughs> Satan's oh. crash of my Christian. <laughs> Welcome. I'm gonna bring my fruit Who's got the devil's lettuce in here? Yeah, I would say smell weed, but that's, that's a normal you thing. Oh, but it's so fucking. Good. You live in Seattle, yeah, like. Oh, it smells like that so everywhere. many people were hitting uh, just at an Odessa concert. Like, oh, that <laughs> was fun. awesome. That was, was like, so much yeah. fun. Yeah. Anyway, wax. Well, should we do intros? <laughs> 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 I'm surprised he hasn't reeled us in yet. There's now no I've been watching his face just he's to like, see like no, when like, when it like what? we can edit this out. <laughs> <laughs> it's live. We'll edit it this out. B footage. <laughs> Oh, big old gap man. missing it's fine <laughs> drugs uh, and stuff <laughs> it's it, listen it's getting everybody in the right mindset for some cyberpunk shit uh, <laughs> true it, it is. i mean being high as shit off some drugs that don't make no sense or have names i, I, I feel you we do have names for they have names you know, like, <laughs> yeah yeah i have one of them they sell them they have to excellent. have names excellent okay so yeah, why don't we go around the room? Let's do some intros uh, for yourself, your character, any announcements you may have, and uh, let's get into some role play. Uh, Yay! Okay. Jay, starting with me. I yeah. love starting with me. Um, every with your internet's working, uh, I dude, You're it's so you, DJ Khaled. I'm sorry, what? Actually, oh, you, yeah. as you said that, I was buffering for a second. <laughs> Can we not talk about DJ Khaled <laughs> in the middle of my intro? <laughs> I play Kit. Uh, they're they're a really interesting uh, little uh, little person that uh, that gets into spaces and uh, gets out of them really easily. Uh, we're the infiltrator of the group. Um, I do have announcements after this though. When, once we come back, so uh, come back to me after. But uh, whoever's next. Okay, <laughs> Dan. Hi, I'm Domestic Dan. I play Elbereth Vang. Uh, <laughs> not the breath, not the bareth. Any of that, none of that. What about error breath? Uh, error breath. Um, yeah, I play Elbreath, uh, the hunter and uh, uh, Kit's madman to the show. Uh, <laughs> and uh, announcements, I, I'm, I'm playing lots of God of War now because one, I want to finish it because it's good. And I also want to play other things like uh, uh, Donger Simulator with uh, Jay. Um, mm. but oh, I, have to, right. Conan, oh. I have to finish uh, God of War first. And I'll be playing that after this game uh, of Neon Scream because I don't stop. <laughs> <laughs> Next. Don't know what to do with my hands. Uh, Goobers. Hi. Uh, my name is Goobers. <laughs> This is, uh, no, my name is Goobers. Uh, I am playing uh, Angmar. Uh, Angmar is the, what's called the uh, push, pusher, pusher, right? Pusher. My brain. Sorry. Yes. Anyway, it doesn't yes. matter. He's yes. the edgelord of the group. Um, he's he's the edgelord of the group, and he's, he's really, he has a whip, and he's awful and mean. Um, and on my stream, 
Uh, what we're doing is playing nothing but Battletech, even though I'm a variety caster. <laughs> We're just preparing Matt for the rave. <laughs> Hi, I'm Matt. I'm going to a rave. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, uh, I stream out here on Twitch full time forever. I don't even want to say how long. Uh, I'm a variety caster, but I play a lot of shooters. Some adventure stuff, uh, but we've really been getting into Destiny right now again, and some Fortnite, and Far Cry Five was awesome, and God of Dad will be like in the summer. God of probably. Soy. God of Soy. God of Soy. Soy the God. Soy. Soy. I, I just I'm going to a rave. You should totally fuck with like so many people there too, Mav. You got to do. I like have you, Dude, you guys, you like, have, have ask you ever done Goofs this? and Dan. Like, I fuck with people at conventions. Like, I cannot wait to have, have people you, who have no idea what's have going on. Have you ever done the slow motion to somebody that's really <laughs> fucked up? Dude. Oh, God. Dude. Oh, my God. Oh, God. Man. oh man. Out of their mind and yes. out. That, that <laughs> or the invisible box, but you can't do the invisible box at a fucking race. Oh, that one the, sounded the good. slow motion is the best. That's yeah. my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> so good. I seen the invisible box done. It was actually at that festival. And so it fucking fell. <laughs> People fucking lose their shit. <laughs> it's so great. We're so awful. We're, like, we're terrible. Fuck man. with all those stupid rape kids. Just like, oh god. Yeah, hey, get them, get them high, so and angry. then fuck with them. <laughs> hey everybody, I'm Wax Steven. I am the MC of Doom here in this campaign. I will be dragging <laughs> players, kicking and screaming through the adventure today. It <laughs> will be. Great. Fuck. We're not high. <laughs> it got me. <laughs> Fuck. On now. Hey, let's, let's speak for yourself, okay? Speak for yourself. Enough? <laughs> I didn't say at all. I just said enough. So, all right. All right again, cool. speak for yourself. <laughs> uh, yeah, as far as announcements go, we got a lot of shit going on. And I know I keep saying this mm. for Table Story going on behind the scenes. I'm doing, I'm like, I, I am just constantly working, like nonstop work. There's so much shit going on for Table Story. Um, we got a bunch of announcements that we're gonna make. Um, probably, uh, I think we're. Pro I'm probably gonna make one of them tomorrow. Probably one tomorrow is my guess. On your stream? Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. Uh, There's probably probably one announcement tomorrow of many. There are there are many coming up this month. So. You should you should fucking stay tuned. <laughs> Prepare yourselves. Thanks for fucking. Shut God the damn fuck up! I didn't fucking. God God damn it, Dave! Listen, I don't type. I didn't learn. Canada doesn't have <laughs> internet. Okay, we didn't learn. We can do it, David. You didn't say you're sorry. I don't know if you're a real Canadian. I'm no, not. I'm fake. <laughs> fake Canadian. But uh, yeah, we got a lot of shit going on. So you stay American. <laughs> um, <laughs> and uh, as far as what's going on in this show. Uh, I need a little refresher for last session. Pip, um, I, Pip, <laughs> Pip's character was kind of fucking with some people that she probably shouldn't have. Um, choices were made, things were done, and Siren decided to, uh, encourage... Susan to try and find some backup, some other hackers to help her with this whole plan that the group has kind of worked out as they are trying to uh, essentially sabotage the space elevator uh, so that these uh, streamers from Sensex die on it and make it look like the people that are running the space elevator, Teslamazon, are the culprits. And, um, well, there's been some planning and things that hasn't gone super smoothly thus far, um, but they're making progress. Elbereth and Kit are sort of out in the field, and they've run into a few problems, namely four clone-like problems, uh, a sort of 
um, katana wielding, Uzi wielding group of problems. Uh, they took some damage, but they went ahead and they got themselves fixed up. Fixed up in a uh, what did we end up calling the booth? Uh, oh, it was uh, uh, farm emergency. Farm farm emer yeah, farm emergency booth. Yeah, the farm emergency booth. Yeah. Uh, a sort of economy surgery booth um, that uh, <laughs> that exists in some of the um, in some of the areas in the sprawl. Um, they got themselves fixed up, and um, yeah, they got themselves healed up at a cost. They had to spend <laughs> cred to do that, and um, Angmar. El 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 Elbrad tried to trade drugs to for a machine. <laughs> to a machine. I just wanted to. I want to sell them. Do you buy drugs? Can I just bring Alvareth tomorrow? Like, just... <laughs> That's where you'll pawn the drugs. I'm yeah. It's locked up right now. <laughs> I'm trying to smash it for a shirt or a PBJ sandwich. That's what I see it, Mav. That's, that's what's going to happen. Yeah. Oh, God. I, I, I wish I... Like... <laughs> I wish it was streamed, <laughs> cause goddamn, I'm I just want to see Mav's reaction. That's the only Mav, thing I want to see. You should just really just me. IRL stream your face the entire time, where it's just like it's like your face, but it's like you just like. <laughs> <laughs> I should bring a cane that lights up. <laughs> just the whole fucking time. Goddamn remote. <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry. Right. Right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, uh, it's oh God, the reactions would be so pricey. <laughs> um, the best thing ever. Um, <laughs> but yeah, um, so so Angmar, Susan, and uh, Siren, back at the warehouse for Downlink, have been trying to do what they can on their end to get the plan sort of worked out. But uh, as I said. Siren and Susan uh, decided to check on their hacker support uh, person by the name of Blizzard, the Blizzard. <laughs> and things didn't go so well. Um, mainly, uh, Siren was sort of caught. And uh, I think I think she had to do her <clears throat> um, she had to sort of log out, or she had to do her jack jack out move, right? She made it out, ended? right? Yeah, she because she, she rolled like she a demon. Yeah, she didn't want to like do it bad. You but you let her. She was in trouble. You let her roll, and I think she got out fine. Yeah, she rolled like a god, like doing all that stuff. Yeah, she yeah. rolled a she rolled a twelve to get out. I think. Okay. Just looking up at it, or maybe not. I'm not sure. Oh no, we ended with a six. Oh yeah, was no, that, that the... was no? That was the cool. That was the don't get detected stuff. Hmm. Um, is jacking out edge? Jacking out is a move. It's a dangerous move for the matrix. Uh, I think we ended the session last time um, where she hadn't actually gotten out. Or am I am I wrong? I think I think you actually just let her jack out. I because I. I'm not 100 yeah, percent sure, did. but I, I the words the words like yeah you you're not in any like danger you don't have to make the move kind of are she, in my head right she now. waited to jack out. Um, so yes, you had to take out a different was... path. But the computer started freaking out. I remember. Yeah, like, but, well, because she rolled badly on her cool, so she got detected. But yeah, she got detected. So, but no, was able you know to... what she you know what what happened was didn't she tell me she, to call him by his name? She logged in twice. She logged in twice. The first time. Uh, was to inspect the stuff for um, the security at the space elevator. The second one right. was to investigate Blizzard. Yes. And Blizzard, she didn't... I don't think we jacked out at the end there. Oh, yeah, you know, you're oh. right. We she got out of the first the, one. I remember it was like the snow was going all Blizzard's, over. Yeah, Blizzard oh, started yeah. to... Yep. yep. We got there so, together. So... Oh no! <laughs> uh, you hear siren. You hear siren. Just start to say like, Meh. "Crap." Okay. 
and she starts making like all these like weird noises in the chair as she's just kind of like shaking violently in the chair. Um, and uh, yeah, on the screen, Susan, you see like the, the you see like the the ASCII blizzard like start to uh, freeze up on the on the um, the the uh, display. Um, and let's see here. Uh, who wants to make the roll for Siren? Me. Back out. This is I a very that. dangerous roll. I ain't touching it. Yeah, fuck that. Go for it. Go for I it, Susan. Like, I feel like I have to do it. You're gonna do it. You're, okay. You're, so what I want one. you to do, I have to, is uh, what I want you to do is let me see what this move is here. I think this because is because I'm rolling. Don't I get above? You're rolling for her. I mean, I'm right. Well, but I'm managing so she her. Does, I'm like telling her what to do. She so does don't get, I get the plus one <laughs> for uh, doing oh, the. Water. So wait, did she? She did the jack out. That was the cool. Is yeah. that? It? Yeah. And it's she, cool. Ill. I'm pretty sure she did. No, no, no. But... hold on, hold on. Somebody, uh, Inspector D and D, said you could. She, you said she couldn't just jack out because she was on some sort of like super highway thing. The, the information yeah, she could highway, jack yeah. out easy. So there again, yeah. there's there's a there's terminology that's oh, being used here fuck. that's really important because the actual jack out is a move. Logging, oh. logging out is just safely disconnecting. Gotcha. Makes so okay. So log. okay. Jacking out is ripping the jack out of. The oh log. no, she did not do that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So yep. okay. What we're gonna have to she say here out. is, uh, you just you hear her making these noises, Susan, and she says, "I can't log out. <laughs> I'm gonna have to pull the plug." Oh fuck! Wait, 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 Siren, are you sure? Are you sure? Because that would be bad. You know that would be bad. He's well, out there. That would be really bad. What do you need? What do you need from me? I need. I need someone to stop him. He's going to find me. Just keep moving. I'll, th I'll think of something. Can I call Angmar? He's in the other office. So I can like yell down the hallway? Yeah. Angmar! And you just see me like laying my head out the 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 thing. Stop! What? We have a situation. All right. So I I it's kind of oh shit! I hold the ass down there. What is it? What? Siren is in trouble. What do you want me to do? What happened? What kind uh, of trouble? Okay. So maybe long story short, we're trying to get a guy, and then we made him mad, and he's a hacker too, and he is going to catch her. She can't log out. Uh, she's gonna. She's gonna try to. to it's not gonna be good. She's I not logging safely. Yeah, um, it's gonna be uh, bad. Can we she not get him to bad. stop? Are you in contact with him? Maybe we made him really mad. Are you still talking to him? He's still I around. I triggered an alert. Oh God. We're in trouble. What do, we, what, uh, what do you want? What do you want to do? Are you in contact with him still? Yes. And yes? I show him the text. <laughs> You can see the display is just, it looks like, you know, uh, the the area I'm around the, the display are just like solidifying and ASCII, you know, and it just keeps like closing in and just, it looks like- uh, I'm, uh, I, 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 uh, I take the phone, or no, I say, I say, uh, tell, ask him to stop. Just ask him to stop. Send it now. Just do it. Stop. Send. <laughs> see what he says. Um, okay. <laughs> yeah, so he just he just types back too late now. What do you want? Um Okay, so he <laughs> he just replies back um He replies back uh for people not to fuck with me. Say say to him, Susan, say to him, we needed to be sure of your talents. Send. 
if you do this for us, we'll. Can I tell him if we do this for us, that we'll never bug him again. We'll make sure he never gets bugged again. Just, just wait, wait for what he says. Wait for what he okay. says. This might be a good thing for us. Just, just send that message and wait. Um. Okay. This is a move for sure. <laughs> no. This is a fast talk from you, Susan. Oh shit! Oh, no. your style. Well, the only yeah. thing that we sent to him, just to be clear, is just we needed to be sure of your talent. Bus. Just so that we know, like that's still a move there. Bus. Oh yeah, this is definitely Bus. a move. All right. Bus. Bus. All right, come on, Susan. Dude, she come didn't. On, she didn't do pre rolls either. Here we go. Are you sure? Because <laughs> like, I have to roll my cool. My uh, edge. No, no, this edge. is plus your style. My style. No. Plus your style. No! <laughs> 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 um, now let me just check. Siren. I get anything from Angmar from telling me to do anything, or am I the one that? So, <laughs> yeah, you're the one that tells so, that. Angmar. But uh, I told him to tell me. I mean, is that no, like? No, no. You're, gonna, you're gonna get links with uh, Siren, I think. Um, Siren's gonna roll plus her. She's no. the one that's kind of directly helping. Yeah. Uh, she does not have any link with you, so this is just a flat two d six from her. I'm gonna roll for her. <laughs> oh God. That's an Ooh, 11. That's cool. So plus one. That's a plus one bonus. So it's a plus one to yours. So I'm 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 just. And I yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm just zero now. That's fine. Well, that's better <laughs> than a minus. It's better. So what do I do? I just roll and then. Plus your style, and we'll see what happens. I just roll my style, and then it's plus one. Yeah, one forward. <laughs> Six. Uh oh. That's a six. No. So the, so I mean, that's a five still, seven, right? Five. And add the one in. Oh no. Um, so this is so this is a uh, five. Yeah. This I mean, that five. doesn't change anything. This is six. Two. Oh damn it. Six. I mean, it could go either way. It's like yeah. not good or bad. It's no, no, no that's, that's definitely bad. bad. That's a miss. <laughs> that's, that's bad. That's a miss. Okay. So. Oh no. Um, so yeah. Are you sure? Uh. So yeah, Blizzard just says. Uh, nice try. You just start to see the display like get more like frozen and frozen, and you see uh, Siren is just kind of like in her chair and she's just kind of like shaking. She's like, "Guys, any help?" She needs a jack out. She needs a jack out, Emma. She has to go. Make the call. Out. You're the leader. Jack Make the out. Call. Okay, jack out. Fuck. And uh, please go ahead and roll me a two d six. And technically, uh, this is part of the mission, and uh, I think this is plus help, so plus two forward on this. Oh, yeah, because of her uh, sirens thing. Oh, oh wait, how do, I, how do I do that? Uh, <laughs> it's slash, <laughs> slash roll. 2d6 plus two. Okay, that's what I thought. <clears throat> I forgot. Okay, an eight on her jack out. That too really helped. Mm -hmm. yeah. wow. Yes, it did. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It would have been real bad otherwise. Yep. You jack out, but choose one. You lose some data. You take some of the established consequences. The owners of the target system trace you to your current location. Wait, say that again. You oh, lose some you. data. You take some of the established <gasps> consequences. The owners of the target system trace you to your current location. I'm gonna lose some data. Okay. So you, you just hear this Probably like, ah! yeah. which makes sense, yeah. And she's just kind of like wide-eyed and you hear her like. <gasps> Simon, you're here, you're, you're safe, you're safe. <gasps> you're safe! <laughs> Fuck, that hurts. Susan, she's gonna need a moment. I've seen this happen before. Oh. She's really disoriented right now and just needs- What does she need? What do you think she needs? Just to scream in pain for a little bit. She'll be fine. Oh. She's just like, like okay. moaning, like holding, holding her neck, um, like the, the back of her- um, the Maybe back we could get Arthur to go get some tea. Arthur! I thought, where the fuck is a tea? 
There's tea all over the table. Like it's right in front of you. I'm fresh. <laughs> <clears throat> Arthur walks in like <laughs> uh, three seconds later and he's just like uh whip well, we don't have any tea left there's... we'll go talk to a distributor guy no. there's, there's gotta be someone out there that can go get tea uh, well, no, no, it's fine it's fine it's fine it's we're going to get tea later for for Siren. For now, thank you, Arthur, for your time. I'm, I'm sure we could find some tea around us as I kind of gesture towards, like, the 30 cups that are now on the desk, ground, <laughs> shelves, and, like, somehow there's one on the ceiling? Like, it's been put <laughs> above, like, I don't know. Anyway. Um, so, okay. So... Does somebody want to fill me in on what the fuck just happened? Uh, well, uh, so we needed to find a help and I decided to ask her to uh, talk to someone for me and we wanted to figure out his information and uh, we were just not very nice about it. So then you pissed off a hacker and he tried to kill Siren. Yep. That's, it could be worse. She could be dead. We still have her. Yeah. I suppose that's true. Siren, do you think that this is going to bite us in the ass at all moving forward or what? Did we lose anything out of that? What happened? And she's just kind of like looking at the wall, like. Well, what we need to do is we need to get her help. So I think we should, when she's feeling a little better, ask her if she knows anybody. Because <laughs> I don't think I picked the right one. Yeah, she's still pretty messed up. Well, <laughs> I'm gonna go back and continue to look and work on my stuff, but. But what are you working on? What do you What do you need? Um. <clears throat> My brain totally just farted. What the hell is it doing? Um, <laughs> I forgot to. Fuck! <gasps> directives on the screen. Just look at them. <laughs> and there's a point on the screen. I have little bullet points. <laughs> um, Roll 20. Oh, it's over there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, thank you. Um, Roll 20. <laughs> no, yeah. it was something else. I'm supposed to be doing something else. Oh, fuck. Um, weren't we, you're talking to Kit and them about what's going on with them? Did you have to talk? What? You were we going to okay. do that about sending them over there. I apologize, guys. My brain has just stopped. I knew it before going into the session. What the fuck? Um, all right. Oh, land security. For the sake of the, the, sake of the RP. <laughs> Fixing my door. Yeah. Um, <laughs> So what do you want to do next? We're going to uh, wait for Siren to figure it out, but we still have to get the information and we still need to check the area. So oh, what do you want to do? Why don't, why don't you stay here and work with Siren? Get another hacker. Get somebody that's better that can help out. Do you want me to call? No, 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 no. <laughs> what? What, what? What? It's fine, Siren. It's fine. What were you saying? Do you want to call who? Uh, do you want me to call Kit and Elbereth? Yes, we need them, or we need them to tell us what they're up to or the information they have. Like, we need to have them tell us what we need to do. Are we going to give them the information to go talk about, go send them to the bunker? To try to if find they're not them dead, if they're not dead and ready to go, then yeah, I think you should do that. You should totally do that. Okay. I want you to call those two and tell them what they need to do. All right, I can see what I can do. And I, I head back to my office to go to go do just that. Okay. Um, uh, both Kit and Elbereth 
are currently indisposed. <laughs> well, how long did the jack? This is, how long did the jacking in and all that take? Um, that was roughly little... the same time. So yeah, it happened about the same time. Uh, so I'm wondering, yeah, are we indisposed after or during or both? <laughs> <laughs> and how long, if both? <laughs> So you're both just high as fuck right now, right? Well, we, got, uh, we just well, got yeah. it. Yeah. You got surgery. It, Wax said one hour? One hour, yeah. Yep. So you guys you guys are probably awake, but you're still, like, anesthetized. So there's a right. lot of, a lot of like, <clears throat> strange, like, hallucinations and shit that you're seeing sure. right now, for sure. Like, it's just, it's like some strong shit that knocked you out. Shit. How how long do we have left, mm -hmm. I guess, is the, is the next question. Don't know. Okay. Mm. Fair enough. We don't. I, yeah, I guess if, we, if we're in this state, we have no idea how much time has passed. We're just like, Kit was on the bench. Yeah, like, we are. We we're probably I like sat, I wouldn't sat down next to them. Like face up, just looking at the sky. Um, we're we're awake. We're we're like uh, we are awake. Yeah. Oh, actually, yeah. I don't know if I had. Uh, did I get my? I think I asked if the, my clothes could get dry clean while I was in there. <laughs> <laughs> Did my clothes um, get clean? The 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 sonic uh, the sonic shower uh, is probably a, a standard feature. Yeah, oh. uh, that happened to hit the, to Kit before when Kit was like, "I want to be mm -hmm. cool." So there was definitely yeah. like a scene where where Elbereth got ejected from the from the <laughs> booth, and just kind of like. Maybe they have some like encouragement, like a hand that just comes out and like Yeah, <laughs> just like or, or maybe like the wall just kinda like pushes out and just kinda like fills the entire place, yep. shoving you out. <laughs> yep. Um so I just sit down next mm. to Kit high as a kite. Is this where Angmar Ang is Angmar calling us right now or are you I haven't no? called you yet? Okay. No, this is I, sometime during the hacking, yeah, I think. Gotcha. This is this is during the hacking, I'd okay. say, yeah. <clears throat> Um, yeah, we... I don't have bullets anymore! We don't have a face. I think I do. We lost it. I lost an eye! You lost an eye. I lost an eye! <clears throat> we think you look cool. Thanks! I, I don't know what I look like anymore! You look like you have one less eye. Oh! I feel like this goes on for at least a half an hour. <laughs> <laughs> With every five minutes or so, it's just that about eye. the eye again. It's, it's yeah. a repeating conversation. <laughs> it's, it's the same conversation for about a half an hour. Oh. <laughs> there's, a great scene, there's a great scene in the show, The Magicians. Um, where they get lost in this forest where they get high in and they just keep, they do that skit. They do oh, it like man. five times. Like it's just the same fucking thing. <laughs> we should brilliant. go left and they go left, and they just come back to it and like, we should go left and they just keep going left <laughs> and they keep getting lost in this fucking forest. Oh, man. That's great. Um, yeah. So, uh, th there's, there's a good chunk of time where you guys are just making nonsensical comments to each other. Probably a few people pass by. They're probably used to seeing weird shit near the near the farm emergency booth. Yeah, mm. and it's a it's a rich enough area that it's honestly safe enough for us to sit there. From what you had mentioned, it was it was fairly probably yeah. sure. It's cyberpunk. Fuck. I don't like that smile, man. Come on. No, I see he gave us a plus two earlier on Pip's roll, and now he fucking kills us. That's the deal. That's what happens. Yeah. I have to lure uh, you into a, a false sense of security, lull you into a false sense of security. We've never had that. <laughs> I have. One time. I, I fucked up. <laughs> I fucked up. I got I got safe. Oh, um, man. While you guys are sitting there, whenever the time frame is, I don't know how long it's been, but I do call you. I'll let Wack know, or Which, let us let me know oh. how how high I am. <laughs> uh, give me an act under pressure. Are we talking about like rave high or are we... Uh... Right, exactly. Like act under pressure. Secondhand okay. rave high or like firsthand... Are we talking about freak out because of the invisible box? Whoa! Okay. Whoa! Elbereth, the call just kind of sobers you right up. 
No, look at Scoopers. Why did, you, why did I use it on that of all things? Wait, oh. can we make can we make Jay do uh, a fucking high roll? Oh, as fuck. well? Kit, uh, this. yeah, Kit, you can act under pressure. I got fucking this. twelve on a damn. This is my my star roll. Nice. That's pretty There's fucking good. Ish. Okay. Yeah, that's so a 10. Enough, that's more than that's a 10. Enough, yeah. enough time has passed where you guys have kind of sobered up at this point. What does my eye look like? I mean, like, it, it was damaged. Did the surgery, did it get, they, like, removed? Yeah, they, 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 like, they cleaned the wound, closed it up. Okay. Oh. Sterilized so it's just, it. It just, it's, it's, flap. it's so that kind of thing. Like, you got a skin flap. <laughs> well, you got your eye looks in there. They're there. There's just the eye is all fucked up inside. Right, um, yeah. probably sterilized it. I don't know, but they cut that's it. What I'm asking. They probably would cut it out. They, yeah, right. they would take the eye out. Yeah, yeah that's take it out. Yeah. So it's just a socket. Okay. Yeah. Um. Plot. Yeah. Uh. So yeah, you'd get you'd I'd I'd pull up my my video call for you at this point. Would I see um, your face? For a Can video you, call, yeah. I just like video call. I just I I I I give you a call. I'm gonna see you and then just. Oh! Oh. I don't look any worse than you. You haven't seen me without my mask, but that's fair. Anyway, you okay? What the hell happened? We're fine now. We had to take uh, a quick detour to a medical pod. How are you yeah. feeling, kid? We're okay. They're all right. Ish. Ish. So... Yeah. Um, yes, we're outside the apartments we need to be at the, for the stakeout spot. Right. I can actually see the elevator from here. It's very nice. Anyway, yes, uh, have you looked into the, uh, uh, the data I gave you on those, uh, assailants? I haven't had time. Now, unfortunately, um, we had an issue of our own here. Siren almost got... Well, captured by a hacker in the in the Matrix. Um, well, that's inconvenient. Yes, but she made it out. We might have lost something, but uh, Susan and Siren are working on finding a a backup or somebody else without a cataclysmic of side side effects. Anyway, um, Susan wanted me to mention to you, since she's taking care of Siren right now. Once you guys are done looking at this lookout point, depending on how things go, if it turns out to be a good place, use it. However, there is another location uh, my people have been looking into. Uh, once you're done looking there, we're gonna have you search for this military bunker that Susan seems to think might be there, might not be there, we're not sure. But since we have enough time, if you can find it, and it is there, and it is a place that's going to assist, it would be even better than where you're looking at now. Yes, that's good to know. They might not be terribly... hospitable at the heart, the place we're going now. So depending on how that works out, and how kids able to use their wiles, uh, we'll, uh, we'll see, we'll see. That's not a bad idea, though, if it's close to the place. We're still we're about a mile away from where we want to be here. But it's a good... I what Susan said, that she thinks that it might be a similar distance as well. Oh, that may not be that much better, then. But we'll see. <laughs> we'll keep you posted. We need to go meet with them now. I'm sure they're chomping at the bit for as to why we took an hour since arrival. Oh, because I didn't want to die, you fucking bitch. Right. Well, good luck with that. Maybe don't call her a fucking bitch, but it's your job. You can handle it, I'm sure. No, I'm much nicer in bed. <laughs> As we have seen. Well, good luck on your mission, and don't lose any more eyes. I don't think you can afford it at this point. <laughs> no, I don't think so without tearing it out of one of me. Right. Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> it's just like, I pause and I'm like, he keeps talking about how he's a clown. That's so fucking weird. Uh, <laughs> God damn it. Uh, it's, an, it's a great character. <laughs> it is. Should we Kit. go upstairs? 
I think that'd be a splendid idea. We agree. We're before, before, if it comes to killing her, if it does, before you do that, I have some sober from one of our little attackers earlier. And I don't like using drugs, but I do like selling them. Are you... I'll see if she'll buy it, says I'm kind of broke after, you know, the whole being cut open like a fish. Okay. We need to take a look at her place first. Um, oh, right. Yes. Can I go ahead and use one of my moves here, Wack? Um, what move would you like to do? I would like to do covert entry and attempt to infiltrate... <clears throat> Sally Sallerson's. I, I, I'm thinking like either that or it's either that or a complex across the way so I can see into the place. Um, you tell me. Um, just just a quick uh, general like, are there any windows here? Can I can I roll like an assess before doing this or should I? Um, yeah, I mean, you can roll an assess if you want. Cool. I mean, it's going to give you oh. a sort of um better information possibly okay um just real quick with the with the medical the farm urgency are we were just stabilized we don't lose any no uh, we were we were healed no, you're healed oh full, full. oh fuck yeah good. bud that's what i'm yep. talking about okay cool yeah uh yeah i would like to assess then I'll roll yeah that. you guys you guys spent a cred so yeah uh seven no that's a nine, nine. <laughs> i read six plus one <laughs> counting is fun oh. boop, 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 boop. So uh, you gain one hold in the ensuing action. You may spend one hold at any time to ask, an, to ask uh, the MC a question from the list below. If your examination could have revealed the answer. And you get a plus one forward when acting on the answers. Okay. Um, all right. All right. I'm actually, um, I'm actually going to hold on to that if I can. I'm going to hold on to my hold. Okay. Um, and uh, I'd like to do my uh, which, my which which are you doing? Are you going into her place or the place across the street? I'm gonna go into her place. I'm gonna go into her place there. Oh, okay. sorry, sorry. Um, are, are are there like windows on the exterior, or is it uh, kind yeah, of? Yeah, there's definitely windows. There's windows and balconies. Okay. The thing that we referenced, the thing that I referenced oh, last time, was I that remember. building, um, the like building complex in China, yeah. the yeah. apartment complex where they have all these crazy geometric mm. fucking. Perfect. Uh, that are kind of tacked onto each other, and it's just a mega complex. It's, it looks like a fucking like R type from fucking Sim City, like the old mm. school ones. Uh, okay. Um. Cool. Yeah. So we're gonna we're gonna roll the cool then, and we're gonna try and infiltrate alone. Um. Do I get? Do I get forward for acting on my assess now or no? You have or, to ask the question. I, I didn't first, ask the question. So okay. So I'll just yeah. roll. Uh, yeah, nine. 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 Okay, on your infiltration Fuck. or covert covert entry. Should have gotten okay. that forward. When yeah. you attempt to infiltrate a secure area alone, roll cool, and uh, you gain one hold as MC describes the infiltration and security measures you must overcome. You may spend one hold to describe how you overcome the obstacle. Okay, so the complex... Um, I'm trying to find uh, I'm trying to find that image again because it was a really good reference. I don't remember the keywords that I used, um, but yeah, it's it's like a weird kind of setup where the buildings almost overlap a little bit. Mm. It's got a an interlocking kind of look, so all these different sort of balconies like overlap other 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 parts of the complex, and it's a kind of a weird setup, but it's massive. And there's just like a million of these fucking things, um, and uh, I guess when you when you head towards the nearest entrance, of mm -hmm. which there are many, um, you can see that there's like a um, just like a security gate. There's just like a straight up like security gate. Um, it's got a, a plainly visible camera behind the gate, mm. and um, it's like a just it's like a metal gate with a security door on it. Uh, can we just hop it? How high is it? So I'm gonna say you can't just hop it. Um, okay. it's it's got like the the bars that kind of bend mm. outwards. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So um, it'd be super hard to do. Um, 
Well, okay. Um, we'll just give her a call real quick. Okay. Um, wait for her to pick up. <sighs> you Hello. again? We need access to your building. Can we come in? What, like now? You're outside? Yes. I guess. Okay. Thank you. Hang on a second. I'll I'll buzz you in. Okay. Okay, cool. Um we're going to walk through the gate and uh did how many floors up? Was it? So, I think we said it was like J, J, J something. Or 22. 22. Okay. Um 16. Cool. So I'll follow behind if they're just if you're just walking through the gate. Yeah, we're just walking through the gates right now. I saw um, you like trying to do your thing, and then you just walked through. So, right. oh yeah, we're. Um, <laughs> I'd like to use my uh, other move real quick and try and see if there's any security weaknesses uh, with case to joint. If I can just kind of look up and see if there's any any security weaknesses on like the bottom few floors and just assume that they're similar so, up top so keep in mind uh if elbereth is going with you your move does not count anymore to cover i'm i'm still going solo if he's just following me into the gates i was still go going up solo that's it if yeah. he goes up on we his own right. i'm not going to follow him okay yeah, yeah we're just going to uh, go up solo Pace the joint you, it, yeah when you take the time to examine a location for security weaknesses you can exploit roll plus your edge That's a five. Fuck. Oh! God damn it. Uh, All right. Yeah, unfortunately, you gain no intel on this place. It just looks like a fucking apartment complex. Like That's fine. It's, it's got like a, it's a gated apartment complex. There's a lot of inside. I think once you go inside, there's kind of like a lot of uh, like city plants. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? Yep. Like the, the, the plants that they kind of have to put like in almost like in commercial buildings just to mm -hmm. make the place not look horrible. Um, this place is beyond packed with apartments. They're just stacked on top of each other like crazy. Hmm. The The whole place is massive. So you're going through and you can hear like um, people out on their balconies just kind of like talking to other people. Um, it's kind of like obnoxious like how loud it is, I guess, hmm. just from like overhearing people's conversations and shit. Um, you can see that like in immediately in front of you, um, it leads to like kind of a courtyard area where there is uh, sort of like a communal space, I guess. And there's like a um, there's like a like some trees and stuff planted in the center with some benches around it. Maybe like um, like a fountain or something in there. Um, okay. And uh, th I'd say there's like three people like seated at the benches. You can see that they're quite obviously like getting high out of their fucking minds. <laughs> Okay. Um, cool. We're gonna go up to the uh... giving Mav a preview. <laughs> <laughs> Except it's going to be thousands of people on benches. No, they're just gonna be standing. Yeah. Never mind. Yeah, we're gonna go up to the twenty-second floor, but we'll uh, we'll take the stairs. Okay. Um, yeah. So it's like a fucking maze in there, but you kind of eventually find the right mm. like stairway. They've got like all these signs and everything everywhere. Um, that say where to go, um, and uh, eventually you find the staircase uh, for straight, straight to the location. Mm. Um, it, yeah, I mean she's up somewhere in the middle of the apartment complex. I can't remember what what apartment we said. It was I think it was J something. Yeah. Um, yeah. Okay. And uh, yeah, so I mean you just head straight there. It's almost like a condo kind of complex, but because of the way that the apartments are kind of laid out. There's like blocks that kind of are on weird angles mm. and shit like that. So you're like walking on top of like people's apartments almost like as you're crossing over the okay. walkway and such. Um, yeah, and you can see there's, uh, they use kind of this open areas to like have trees planted on things. And mm. yeah, it's, I mean, it's okay. a really nice place, especially considering what the rest of the sprawl is like. Um, extreme contrasts in, in the rich and poor areas. Oh, uh, okay. I'd like the to... apartments are all very small, though, just an FYI. Oh. Like, they're pretty small. Okay. Um, Can I spend a point in my hold? Uh, I want to ask, um, in, in, in this 
complex, especially. Uh, how can we avoid trouble or hide here? Oh man, there's a lot of places to hide. Okay. Um, I think that uh, finding a place to hide that's not visible by cameras, there are security cameras mm -hmm. all over the place, um, is the tricky part. And I would say that um, you're able to kind of like navigate a path um, if you kind of go off of the, the actual um, like crossways mm. and such. Like you, you actually maybe you decide not to walk the 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 actual um, the walkways. If you hop, if you like hop over to somebody's balcony, or mm. if you sort of hop onto into some of the foliage and stuff that's set up, um, you might be able to kind of like hang off the side. You're gonna have to do some work to kind of stay at a camera view. Okay, but it is doable. Okay. Um. Yeah, that was that was it. We'll uh, we'll go and uh, get Elbereth. Kind of wh wherever he is, whether if you're wandering around the building or if you're still down in the courtyard. <clears throat> I like I knew where. So you what, spent your apartment. I spent one hold. I didn't spend the other one though. So you spent your hold for the assess, mm -hmm. which is the question you just asked. So yeah. your covert entry, I you, have, you have to be by yourself to activate that stuff. So just be aware of that. That's part of your move. Yeah, yeah. That was just for, for infiltrating. Um, okay. Mm, yeah, no, no, fuck, I didn't spend like, my whole- I probably would have just wandered myself up to like the actual apartment. Okay. Because I just had the, the apartment number. I saw him go up, or saw them like run off and start doing their thing. Like, eh. And I just walked up to the apartment. Yeah, so, just, yeah, so we first, would just probably meet up. Right? Yep, the, I'd just I be waiting Elbereth outside the gets there first. Yeah. Yeah. So <clears throat> do you wait for Kit, Elbereth? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. It's not my contact. I just wait. Yeah, cool. Okay. We'll walk up and. So you see Elbereth <laughs> probably like leaning against the, the railing or something for the, for the floor. The area huh. looks secure ish. Good to know. Ish? We can't see inside her apartment. We're no. not sure. We're about to. We're just worried there might be more clones. Right. That is a good point. Mm -hmm. Well, we'll see, won't we? Hmm. She also mentioned Pharma U. Or was it U Plus? It was U Plus, right? Mark? It was U Plus. Yeah. Um, she also mentioned U Plus, so... I mentioned about what with them? That we apparently work for them. I mean, technically I have in the past and still sort of do. But we also, we established that the clones were from U Plus. So we were. Oh, worried. yes. Yes. And then we're just going to on our door <laughs> if we can. <laughs> She's like, give me a minute. Okay. Clomp, clomp, clomp. Opens the door. That was seven seconds. She's rather prompt. I like that. So, yeah, looking at <laughs> Sally, uh, I think Sally's, like, really strung out looking. Like, she's hmm. very, very skinny. Um, and uh, she's got, like, kind of sunken cheeks. Probably has some, like, bags under her eyes. Um... She's pretty, but like you could tell that she's she's looked better. You know what I mean? Overworked, like that kind of mm. like crunch yeah. week, but for three months. Yeah, or worse. Um, yeah. So, um, she says, "Uh, this couldn't wait." You sounded impatient an hour ago, so it did wait. We're sorry. Okay, so do you want to look at the place? Yes, please. Also, what was the task you asked us to do again? She like looks outside. She's like, not out there. Um, can I quickly assess her apartment, like just from what I see, or like just from the door? Yeah, it's gonna be pretty limited for sure. Okay. Okay, that's a nine. Uh, you're gonna gain one hold <clears throat> from the list. Um, what do I notice despite an effort to conceal it? 
She's got a weapon on her. Oh, okay, that's fine. Yeah, it's we'll go in. Probably, yeah, she probably has like some kind of. I think if she's got like a gun hmm. that you maybe catch a glimpse of. She's probably got it like tucked into her waistband or some stupid fucking crap like that. Okay. Well, like, well, like, just kind of stare at it or something. Try something to you never ever ever want to do ever. <laughs> no. Are you trying to get my attention? Try to, to yeah. Try to just kind of, and then we'll go oh, okay. in. Okay. And yeah, then I'd probably hopefully he'll see. I like, probably know, but hi. Uh, by the way, I'm sorry we weren't introduced. I'm the friend he was speaking of, Elbrus Vang. It's a pleasure, Miss Sally. It's good to meet you, Sally. I like what you've done with your hair. It's whatever. I just you know, work is kind of work. Oh, I get that. Can we come in? Uh, yeah, okay. I didn't want to push past you, is all. We've already. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she just like looks a kid walking in. <laughs> so inside, um, I think that Sally probably has like a somewhat messy place. It's not like crazy, but it's definitely like lived in. She's like, I didn't have a chance to clean up. That's okay. That's just fine. So, what was the job you needed again? So she says, do you want a drink? No, thank you. What was the job you needed again? You, Elbereth? <laughs> uh, please, thank you, He's miss. okay as well. What was the job you needed again? I'll wait for a moment after we speak, I suppose. I pull out a flask. <laughs> mm. She says, so... It's my ex. Mm -hmm. um, he was kind of important to me for a few things. Like, primarily, he was very good at procuring New Eden stuff. You know, just a way to make life fucking drugs. livable. Mm -hmm. You are say yeah. you're saying you need drugs? Well, I'm not saying that I just need drugs. I'm saying that I need his drugs. Oh, right. Yes, a particular deal, a particular flavor. Got it. Okay. We can find him. Um, would drugs suffice now? You you have some or are you I happen he's looking at me like looking up like, for an like I happen to have a just one unfortunately soma tablet that I could sell at a discount if you need something right now give me a Ooh, we selling drugs oh baby. Give me a fast talk. Fast talk. Assassinating stuff. people and selling is, drugs. Is Kit helping me since he just pulled me into this without yeah. me saying? Yeah. All right. Yeah, please, please can. help me, sir. Roll links with breath boy. <laughs> hey. Okay. All right. I'll take that one. Okay. So this is a plus one coming. Oh. From oh. It's a, drug a bus. Lot. Drug oh, bus. the bus. bus. We have That's a drug a bus. bus. Ah, drug bus. She says, she says that, uh, yeah, um, so you don't want it? No, if you want to buy it off of me, I'd be more than happy to sell. Um, give me a minute. Oh, yes, of course. Take your time. You could hear her. Like, she, like, kind of, like, not run, like, outright runs to one of the other rooms, but, like, almost. <laughs> like, pretty close. Like, she walks really fast. <laughs> uh, you can hear her, like, rustling through some shit, like, in the other room. Right. Trying to find every, every yeah. cred hiding <laughs> under the seat cushion. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Um, 
yeah, so she uh, she comes back, and um, let me just double check this here. Yeah, at, at least so Soma standard price is three credit for a yeah. tablet. Damn. And yeah, we so roll she, very damn. Yeah, so she so she says, "This is all I have. I just I." No, no, no! Oh, Miss, honey, it's okay. Uh, it's 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 all I have, okay? Sure. Just, I just, I need it, okay? No, I understand. I have my needs, too. How much is she offering? Um, Yeah, so she's she's going to offer you three cred. Perfect. Whoa! Uh, Whoa! <laughs> that is absolutely fine. I was going to ask for, you've been so accommodating. And I, I hand it over to her. And I remove it from my inventory. Damn, dude. If I complete this mission, let's sell drugs. Let's <laughs> sell <So> drugs. <laughs> Both well, of my characters. That's how you are retire a character. <laughs> oh, man. That is how we retire right there. We sell drugs. We sell drugs. Yep. It's how I made money with Richard last time. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to role playing on Neon Scream. We don't role play, but we sell drugs. <laughs> to be fair, it is something that you guys are also able to use. And if you notice, it's super good. Um, the it, withdrawals are so yeah. bad. No, I refuse to touch the withdrawals. <laughs> it, it's a plus one forward when you roll mind. Um, so it's yeah, very no, nice it, it would have. It, it, it's it's the one thing. Well, for me, that's not great, but for others, it could be incredible but yeah. it also lasts what it doesn't really say how long it lasts uh 30 minutes 30 minutes all right and that, that's last one hour yeah so like wow uh, three fucking cred but i'll take that cool Preach. i'm no longer fucking zero uh <laughs> granted i lent out some but if we die or we fail that doesn't come back <laughs> <laughs> Uh, awesome. Okay. So yeah, I hand her the the Soma. Uh swipe the cred chit. Okay. Yeah, so she just she takes this and it's probably like the slappers from fucking Batman Beyond. Uh yeah. Yeah. And uh she just she like puts it on her on her the inside of her elbow. Um and you could see like it's probably discolored there. Like she probably has yep. like her veins like, are kind of like Fucking it's like yellowing, kind of like like yeah. uh, jaundice or iodine, like after that sort yeah. of color. She just she slaps it on and she's like, "Holy shit!" Every time, it is a good one. <laughs> oh god, she's like, "I have to work. I have to work." And okay. You, she like she like runs to her computer. While you're working, do you mind if we look around? Go ahead, whatever. Awesome. Thank you. She's like, oh I my just... god, this makes so much more sense now. And you... I'm very happy for you, honey. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, I just do this motion to you yeah. while I kind of I go to the windows and just look out the windows. This is like Adderall <laughs> times a thousand, right? Like this is this is the, this is this is the fucking. Um, uh, what was pill? Yeah. 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 Was, yeah. And NZ, NZT. NZT. Yeah. yeah. Um, so I'm going to go over to the windows and do an assess out because it, it was face her. Her apartment was facing the the space elevator. I think that was the whole point mm -hmm. of the con contact. Right. Yeah, yeah. That was that was why we chose them. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, you guys I'm going to see it outside, too. I mean, it's right. Perfect. But I mean, the windows of this place specifically. So yeah. I'm gonna go and look out and uh, kind of do an assess on just the the general, like, cityscape, everything that I can kind of see from like my, my my actual eye. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> the good one. The good. The only, the only one I got. <laughs> my eye. All right. Uh, 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 an eight. Okay, so you get a one hold there. Mm -hmm. Okay. Boka. All right. Um, so 
in the context of being in this apartment, uh, who or what is my biggest threat to this in this situation? So if I'm staking out here, or if Siren's staking out here, even more so, what is the biggest threat? Or who is the biggest threat? I would say the position okay. uh, is the biggest threat. Primarily because you guys had to go through so many walkways to get to here, the central part of the, the fact that this is so central and is complex makes it take a while to get out. Okay. Gotcha. I think Shit, that's the, the that, I feel like that's the thing that you've seen and that's the thing that you would recognize as the biggest problem. Okay. It's not like there's a, it like look out the window. There's a giant security yeah, camera. There's no, yeah, there's no, there's no like like arrow pointing down at this guy. <laughs> right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, that's. I no. mean, that's what I was looking for. So yeah, yeah. that that helps. That helps. Okay. Yeah. It, cool. it, it's just based on stuff you you actually have seen and stuff that's you know plainly piecing it together and nothing else yeah. is. It's just out. it's a very central location in this complex, right? And it's a right. big fucking complex. So if okay. the shit hits the fan and you guys need to get out of there. Mm. It's yeah. not a fast thing. It's a lot of running. Right. Yeah. Okay. There are okay. a lot of places to hide, but... But getting out is the biggest problem. Right. Okay. Um, cool. Okay. I didn't ask what was uh, being concealed for the first time in Assassin ever. Mm. You're welcome. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. After kind of looking around... Um, I uh, I just take a seat on the couch while Kit does their thing. Yeah, we're just gonna get the general layout. Okay. Um, and and so be sure to inspect like every nook and cranny. It's not much bigger than a studio apartment. Mm. Um, it's like a it's like a. Um, I think we said it was a one bedroom. I think it's yeah. a one bedroom. Okay. It's like her um, office and then the living room. Yeah, it, it's it's basically a small living room, um, a small bedroom a bathroom, uh, sort of like a kitchenette area. Mm -hmm. And, um, you know, it, it, do you remember the size of uh, Corbin Dallas's apartment in Fifth Element? It's like a little bit bigger than that. Yeah, I, I don't, but I mean, I'll Google it and I'll he, figure it he out. He just had a studio apartment. It was okay, like you yeah. walk in, yeah. he, fought, he like hit a button, the bed went down and the shower came up, you know? Um, it, yeah, it's the dream. <laughs> It's, it's a, I would I would live in a place like that, dude. I would live anything, in a fully a studio, compact studio apartment. I would. It's like a studio apartment that had a room. Look into tiny it. houses, Jay. Look into tiny houses. That might be something you're interested in. Like, with nope. miniature furniture and shit. I did yeah. buy light bulbs convert, that are about I mean, that big. That chair. People convert storage. <laughs> crates. People convert storage crates. Um, yeah. You know the storage containers. Oh, yeah. oh those are uh, so they cool. Run, they run about a thousand to two thousand dollars. And people buy like two of them, and they turn them into compact houses. And they're it's so fucking cool, cool man. Um, yeah, I I think if um, if it doesn't look like there's any anybody hiding and waiting to spring out from underneath a, a fake couch cushion Definitely or uh, it's it's super yeah. messy. Cool. Um, you know, yeah. uh, in her bedroom especially, like the outer, like where you guys were, like in the living room and stuff, Ooh. is like a little tidied up. I did um, want to go to the balcony if we can. Sure. So it's like a um, like a uh, micro balcony, hmm. you know, like it's basically like enough room for a couple chairs like outside. Hmm. Oh, OK. And yeah. Yeah. Um, I was going to say like one of those balconies on like a cruise ship. <laughs> yes. Yeah. OK. Um, can we assess uh, real quick? Yeah, there won't be any EDM shows on. this. <laughs> oh, I'm going to roll an assess. If I, I mean, can. you don't know that. Never mind. Oh, it was a six. God. I wanted to assess, but I can't assess. Never mind. More boss, please. <laughs> um, uh, I wish I was there. That's a six, right. so no. Uh, <laughs> I um, Elbereth will turn around and actually, what I'm going to do, uh, I want to just assess, actually assess the apartment now. Uh, it's like walk around, look around, see if there's anything like, are there, are there listening devices? <laughs> Cameras, like, <laughs> uh, yeah, you can give me an assess on the apartment, sure. Okay. Oop, that's a oh, there's fuck, 12. then. Okay, that's a twelve. Holy bus! So three, you get All three right. hold. What do I notice despite an effort to conceal? 
This is about <laughs> the, the very maximum tier of assess yeah. that, we, that we have accomplished in this. Event. I know we've done yeah, like six right? different assesses on well, this. I looked outside, but this is where we're going to okay. stay, man. If this is where Not we're going to be staying. In here. Yeah, it's fair. I'm doing uh, my job now. This is this is what I do. I go through people's <laughs> shit. <laughs> okay. So what Are do I notice this by Nesser? To I'm a trash goblin. Um, definitely the evidence of drug use for sure. Um, she's got uh, stuff that's anything aside from that. Like that one should be probably pretty apparent, honestly. <laughs> no, it's it's quite clearly like I think if anything, the the indication that the place was. Like not super clean, uh, considering that she was not expecting you guys. Right. Um, she seems like like she when you guys came in, like she was probably trying to throw some shit out and stuff like that. Gotcha. Um, but I think that I think that you recognize that she tried to hide this. Okay. Uh, from you, she was ashamed of it or something. Yeah. Yeah. It was. It's like a lot. Like she's she's been on. She's clearly been doing a lot of Soma. Right. So something uh, that she's working on, she's very worried about, and she's been she's been highly addicted to Soma to yeah. accomplish whatever she's trying to do. Okay. Um, all right. Well, that's good to know. That's, like, the only thing I find trying to be concealed. That's fine. Um, how can I avoid trouble or hide here? Oh, so wait. Uh, second one? Um, I guess it wouldn't be this. So this will be something you find that's not concealed. Okay. You see a picture of her ex and it's the same guy that cut out your fucking eye. Oh! And that's where we're going to take our break. Oh! <laughs> Damn. Yeah, okay. Oh, All right, damn. cool. We'll be back in three to five. Oh, oh, oh plot twist.
stream brought to you by Triscuits. Triscuits! <laughs> Buy them! Put them in your mouth! The most cyberpunk of all snacks. <laughs> they survived the flare! <laughs> <laughs> you won't, but they will. Buy them! Triscuits! <laughs> Literally cardboard. Um... <laughs> Delicious cardboard. Delicious. <laughs> Oh no! Oh god! That's what it sounds like when you eat one too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, it's the internal it's sound. Like a weedy, except not. <laughs> uh, okay, so welcome back, everybody. Welcome back. Um, so yeah, Elbereth, you see this picture? Uh, you know, it's probably like one of those like um, frames that just like animates or whatever. You know, it's like slides slideshow, like through different pictures of this guy. They have like, you know, they do like couple photos, you know, they've got some selfies and shit like that. I don't say anything. I just do the same kind of thing kid did with the gun on the waist and just like. <laughs> Sorry, you just did the, the thing of like the kid like on the computer and you look like, <laughs> <laughs> that, was, that was pretty much what it was. Beautiful. So, I mean, um, probably one of the few times they've smirked a bit too. Yeah. <laughs> uh, um. All right. Well, now that I noticed that and tuck that away for later, uh, how can I avoid trouble or hide here? Um. I mean, there's pretty obvious things. I mean, there's a lot of places to hide. If you're talking about the apartment complex in general. Um, I'm talking about it, this apartment specifically. Yeah, like what I, yeah, I mean, in here, um, I mean, she's got some closets and, you know, there's like a, there's a, there's a, uh, you know, a shower that probably is like super compact, but has a shower curtain. I mean, is there any like like crawl spaces or you know like access panels or anything in there? Not. Yeah, no. definitely not. No, not in this place. Okay. So hiding would be not really a great idea. Um, so avoiding trouble in here, I like. Uh, my guess is, don't talk about the X. <laughs> I mean, yeah, okay. <laughs> um, all right. And then my final question. Um, I already, like, the biggest threat was the fact that it basically answered the other question of what's the best way in out, like, you have a tiny window or a door. Um, <laughs> well, it's a there's a balcony. I mean, you know. They're right. Yeah. I mean, they're, yeah. Like a balcony 20, 20 stories up or a door. Um, so. I'm going to save my last question. I'm going to hold that hold. Okay. I'll hold that hold. I'm going to write that down. Hold that hold. Um, we'll probably we should report to Angmar. Yes, I think that's a great idea. Hmm. Um, probably don't need to mention. No. Mm. Uh, yeah, I'll give him a call since you're out of a phone currently. Okay, we will keep watch. Sally, do you have an extra phone? I know it's an odd question. I know you're busy. I'm sorry, honey. She says, you mean like not an iPhone? Yeah, something old and lying around. <laughs> Is she just like, like a landline? No, like a burner or something. Oh, no. Okay, no worries. Thanks. Um, and I just plop down on the couch and, and ring Angmar. <sighs> Hello? Yeah, I think we see like Elbereth like lifting up like a bathrobe or something like this and just kind of tossing it out of the way. 
I see a box of Triscuits nearby and start munching. <laughs> what are they called? <laughs> Flare flavored. No, they're they're taste kits. Taste kits. Taste kits. I oh, the box. Really made kit really uncomfortable. That yeah, just taste kits. Taste kits. <laughs> yeah. Just, they're just they're just just the <laughs> They'll survive the flare. We guarantee it. You can also build with it. <laughs> Protect your family. Now only 40% cardboard. <laughs> Used in over 1.3% of all Tesla Amazon projects. <laughs> These fucking Triscuits. <laughs> There's pour water in there. It's like cement it, mix, man. Yeah, I was gonna say they mix it with a cement mixture to increase the stability of it. Rebar. <laughs> oh my. God. Yeah, it's the Triscuits, the replacement to rebar and your daily snack. Fucking homeless people just licking concrete walls. <laughs> oh, no. How are we not the marketing team for Triscuits? I don't know, but I love them. These are the avocado, cilantro, and lime. They're delicious. <laughs> I like the salt and pepper one. <laughs> I like oh, the real one. Do those They're exist the in the sprawl, Whack? Does, does avocado exist in the sprawl anymore? There are many like different like versions. Like fake of avocado. avocado. Like tofu avocado. It's like yeah. avocado. Avocado, avocado is like, right? is like what, what prunes are. Or so you think of prunes, like old people eat them. Now oh avocado. Oh god, just like a dried out avocado. Yeah. Just like... No, that's what it is. We already made, I already made that joke. The star, yep. the, the taste Starbucks avocado frappe. Yep, there yeah. you go. Yes, oh, yes, 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 yes. No. It's one of those things. It's just everywhere. I remember when Nicki Minaj was the great classical music. <laughs> <laughs> so do you do you answer your your iPhone? <laughs> yes, yes, I do. For the love of God. <laughs> Fucking wax. Wax having an aneurysm. <laughs> His fucking hand is like. Gonna keep it yes. down. <laughs> Black, are you winking? Don't don't <laughs> spawn NPCs on them. Don't do it. Hey, Ma, hello. Uh, hello. All right, you, you, did you find something to eat, or are you at a place, a location? Both. Why can't it be both? I didn't say it can't be. Good for you. Uh, how is it looking? <laughs> it's looking all right, actually. Uh, we've got the place. Sally is an absolute dear of a host. He's working hard. So, yeah. we're here about a mile out. Um, I'll send you a picture and a little bit of a thing. It'll help you search. Um, and I just kind of like look at the, uh, the ex-boyfriend picture and just boop. There. A, bit under, bit, a thing we didn't realize would happen, but it seems pretty damn useful now. What? So you just get a picture of like I a slideshow. Yeah, so, yeah. so, so I, I get that, and I'm just like, what? I'll text. You. I don't. I, right. Okay. Uh, context is always important, and I appreciate that. Thank you. Mm -hmm. So, uh, what about escape and uh, mobility from sublocation if things don't go as planned? From here, pretty poor. Hmm. But if Siren is discreet, it won't be a problem. To be fair, for her, if she's not discreet, doesn't matter where she is. Fair. Hmm. I well, we probably have... won't stay in here. Just because, well, is it after us? This is not the best place. Fair. For Siren, Fair. I think it's perfect, honestly. We have it's enough easy. time right now until the mission actually needs to be completed. So we're going to have you check out uh, the information, this potential military bunker site. We've got to look into it a little bit more. So you have some time, but- Wonderful. We'll be sending I'll you over the walks. It'll be good. Because if we do end up having utilizing this location, understanding the layout of the neighborhood, not just the actual apartment itself, will be useful. Wonderful. Um, <clears throat> so, aside from that, hopefully Susan will be getting back on the research. Some of my people are going to be looking in on that. As soon as I know more, 
I'll let you know. You guys can head out there and do what you've done here out there. Good. Yes, have Susan call me when she's got more information on that, uh, the bunker thing. Okay. If it's not that much more useful, they may not need it. Since it's, if it's about the same distance, it might just be more of a problem. But, can't hurt to look into. Agreed. Well, good luck. We'll talk to you soon. Wonderful. Once you have the way to get into the elevator thing, I'll pass that along to Kit. Right, I'm working on that as we speak. Beautiful. All right. I'll talk to you later. Click. I think the oh, scene good. switches to like the uh, downlink warehouse. Um, you know, after you guys have kind of uh, done a little bit of of talking, sirens kind of like tried to like calm down. She says, "That fucking hurts." I'm never doing that again. She's, she's with you, ma'am. Ma'am. I'm listening. I'm here. Oh, okay, okay. <clears throat> well, we don't have tea. Great. Fair. Can someone get it? Maybe that big one. Awesome. But I while we are getting that, uh, since this went so poorly, Siren, um, do you have anyone that you would trust? I would imagine that you would create some sort of friendships along the way in your journeys of your uh, occupation. Is there anybody at all that would be willing or in need of money or literally anything because now we have a hacker after us and it's really bad so we need to move quickly i can look into it i know a few people yes okay you do that i will go situate what's going on with bunker and tea and would you like anything else just the tea please okay okay well let me know if you need anything else. Mm. So I walk out. She's like and... staring at the wall and just kind of like. <laughs> I want to die. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So it's I walk like, by Angmar's room it's and I'm. probably like hangover to right? a thousand, you know. Ugh, I can only imagine. Can't believe she's awake. Maybe eight. <laughs> Hello, Angmar. Yes, can I help you? Uh, so what's going on? Do you find anything? Can we talk to the to the? Uh, Elbereth and Kit found the location, and they seem to think that it it is suitable. It's fairly small, uh, and the only problem is is that there seems to be a lack of escape options out of there. It's on the twenty some floor of this apartment complex and if things go bad getting out is going to be a pretty big issue but for the most part it would work well but it's it mainly just for siren to be protected just in case correct i so will... we just need to make sure no one can get in and if she can't get out right and i, I will also know. be there with her so okay. be both of us. the only reason i'm going to speak up is because mm -hmm. pip isn't here mm -hmm. the only reason uh, so Siren was looking for the bunker. She wanted just like a, like a shithole place. She wanted a place to hide yeah. and be safe. You and guys wanted the apartment for staging. These were two separate things that you guys wanted. Siren was looking for the bunker. Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, the bunker's using... completely different. No, the bunker, the bunker and the apartment. I think, I think you got your wires crossed. No, they were supposed to be used. We were we were going to go to the apartment, and then that's why Kit called the contact is to get the apartment. But then then Susan brought up the bunker as in a place to go and do that would be more or use that would be more safe than the apartment. Yeah, because okay. Siren yeah. wanted a bunker, right, which is which is fine. That was like it's more the idea is that it would potentially be more secure if this bunker had existed, but we didn't have to find it. But at right right now, yeah. So 
So you found a I better Siren, option? From what I remember, I thought Siren wanted a different place. Like she wanted to be away from everybody to do her stuff. Right, which is basically what the apartment is for. We were getting the apartment for The Siren. apartment was like, w was an option for that. And then Susan came in with a better, potential better option of the bunker. Which don't know <laughs> the hard bunker. Yes, right. And then that's when well, that's when okay. Siren was just like, I want that. Mm. Yeah. Well, what do you think, Angmar? You are what do you think? Is it better? Because we haven't even found the bunker yet. We have to send more people out. Do we have enough time? Like, what do you want to do? Because I can do anything. We've got we've got plenty of time right now. We still have Four, four ish days, I think, right? Something like that. Um, we still have about four days to go. So they're done looking over the apartment. Why don't you grab some of one of my people and have them do some research into seeing if this bunker even exists? In the meantime, Elbereth and Kit are surveying the area around the apartment to get more details. Not necessarily pertinent details, but things that could assist in the future if we do go with the apartment. Find okay. one of my people, have them do research see if this place exists from there if it does we send the others if not well we have an apartment okay so what else do you what else do you need everyone well, to do I, I have a i have a contact <clears throat> in charge of getting us a job for uh, land security um get so like a can... quick flash in angmar's head of yeah like... that's <laughs> um, that's why i'm stuttering i'm just like i uh, for lance Security. Anyway, um, so the idea is that if our my contact comes through, um, then is, you, uh, is, is this contact reliable? Uh, uh, yes, yes. Absolutely. Is it someone that you is someone that you you know really well? Have you known them for a while? Because this is a big job, and I need you to be sure that you are at least on a first name basis with this person. Um, you could say that. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Yeah. All right. Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> yep. Um, anyway, so, uh, <laughs> right. So yes, uh, she, uh, they're gonna they're gonna get us the jobs so that um, it's gonna be a lot of jobs. Anyway. Um, All right. So you so, you're looking what? for the land security. Uh, what about do we have anyone working with the Tesla Amazon situation? Like, how are we going to? So Siren is going. I'm going to be with Siren on site, and once. Once Siren gets in and gets access to the Tesla Amazon back end, I guess, uh, mm -hmm. she'll create a problem on the lift and then she'll forward the distress call from the lift to me. In which okay. case, I will talk to the people, the streamers on the lift, and, well, how should I say this? Incompetently tell them how to not save their own lives. If that makes a little bit of sense. Mm -hmm. Yep, totally. Good. You do that. Is there anything else that you you want to do, need to do, gotta have? Well, I we also need to talk to our main contact about this mission and about securing the the contingency plan, the charges. Main for contact. The right. Uh, out of character. That is. Where the fuck is it? Don't swear. <laughs> I wish it was. Um, was I the one that got the job there? I don't think. Yes, I was. Yep. Why didn't I write this down? What the fuck is wrong with was past it me? Miguel? <laughs> no, it wasn't Miguel. Angel. That was... Oh, that was Kit's kid. Oh, yeah, was Miguel Angelo. was mine. That's right, yeah. it was Angelo. Yes, yes, it did. I did write it down. Okay. Angelo. So, okay. As far as our contact, know of Angelo as well, uh, for sure, Susan. He's one of the you higher ups. Because he sent me and to. Like, yep. Yep. So if you want to contact Angelo and get details on how and when and where we're going to pick up the charges, our contingency plan, I'd suggest saying that, maybe not explosive. Okay. All right. Aside will, you, from that, will you talk to your contact? Let me know how that goes. We'll do. All the details. I can do that. Oh, and uh, as soon as you get any sort of information as far as the bunker, send that over to Elvareth and Kit. They will be waiting. So, okay. Okay. So I leave. 
Call out because it's like this big room. Yep. Call out for literally. Who's here? Anybody? <laughs> you. And there's like a bunch of. I'm guessing there's like a bunch of dudes just chilling there, like. Yeah, they're just looking at you kind of like awkwardly. Uh, you and you and you. T. They wa- they walk over. T. If you don't get T. Your spinal cords are going to be pulled out of your mouth by a hacker. <laughs> Go do that. Uh, okay. Uh, <laughs> they, when when she I... says that, when she says that really quick, my head just leans out of the door and I go. <laughs> yes. <laughs> uh, or like this. Go ahead and roll plus your uh you and play hardball. Go ahead and roll plus these, are, your these are my people that I gave her access to. Yeah, I know. Okay. It's a threat. <laughs> it's not just asking something. Fair enough. <laughs> what do I want me? Plus your edge. You're rolling. Can I help as play. well? I'm really edgy though. So like I I stick your head out like <laughs> to see how edgy I am. I can't help yeah. in this one? No. Okay. Are you sure? He said, I'm positive. Just roll, man. <laughs> Fuck. Uh, oh, oh, so close. Okay. okay. That's a nine. Okay. <laughs> Hell so, yeah. Thank if, God. When they attempt to remove you as a threat, but not before suffering the established consequences, they do it, but they want payback. Add them as a threat. They do it, but tell somebody about it. Advance the appropriate mission clock. Um, okay. So they just kind of like look at each other and like, it's just some fucking tea, okay? <laughs> um, you saw what you did to Norman. <laughs> <laughs> His fucking name is Norman. <laughs> I'm writing down in my notes, Guy Susan killed equals Norman. <laughs> we finally <laughs> learned his name. You have to make Norma. sure that keeps popping up. No. <laughs> okay, then I look at the guys next to the tea f- dudes, and I'm like, you. You feel. Come here. You look hella tactical. They walk over. They're just wearing like regular clothes, like regular street clothes. You guys look like you are extremely ready to do something really awesome and amazing. I can't wait to tell you about it. So this is what I need you to do. Are you guys up to do a few things? One thing, one big thing. You're the boss. All right, I need you to go find this bunker. And I show them the information. Okay. The, the rough coordinates. The well, for or a bunker. Like, or the rough coordinates, maybe, you, or like... You didn't find a bunker yet, though. <laughs> oh. We have to do I a research role. Yeah. One yeah, of you I need to do, was, I think. Okay. You wanted them to find the bunker for you. I want them to, I want them to go find a bunker. Okay. I wasn't sure if I could say, go find a bunker. Cause okay, I mean, well, I'm totally fine with that too. Mm-hmm. Yeah, a bunker like a bunker. We need a bunker, like a bomb shelter or what yeah, you... a bunker. They all just kind of like look at each other. I mean, okay. Dad, to roll for anything? No. <laughs> yeah. Okay, go. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I know where this is going. Whack! I... Fuck Whack! you, Whack! God damn Come it! On, no! Come on! No. <laughs> I had to. I had to. Oh, he's going to find us a bunker next fucking door. <laughs> like, yeah, right? Next to- <laughs> yeah. <sighs> oh man. So, what's said is said, let that be happening, but Mav, in the future, just specify everything, because okay. Wack will take advantage yeah. of you. Yeah, yeah, I feel this. I feel only... Look at like... that face! Look at that face! It's gonna be a <laughs> right fucking something great us yeah, eyes! Not something. Bob Vista! Finds a bunker in South Florida. I know! <laughs> so, what's gonna, what's gonna happen here is... Oh, uh, no. Um... <laughs> I think this is going to be the closest thing is to hit the street. Roll plus your style, please, um, Susan. Uh, are you sure? Every roll. 
<laughs> you can do it. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I don't think we get some more coffee. <laughs> Why couldn't we just use the tea roll? <laughs> oh no. Uh, okay, well, um. So, what else were you up to besides uh, having people try to find the bunker for you? I was going to call up my buddy Angelo and ask. The info. Ask for what info? Ask about um, how, when, and where to charge what he wants to do. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> so Angelo... Uh, I have to telephone the hell out of this. This is something you know, like, Angelo is, is like one of the one of the higher-ups in, in Downlink, right? Like, he's, he's kind of super hard to meet super mm -hmm. hard to talk to and it has to be done through appropriate channels like ie you have to sort of do do um a, you get sent through a runaround right like you get filtered before you can actually get to angelo um so he usually either contacts people directly and then they do stuff for him or you wait like a long period of time to hear from him Okay. Um, Definitely not the person that you want to be calling for sure. general run-of-the-mill shit. And this is something your character would know for sure. Um, well, I wanted to. I wanted to find out about when he wanted to to do it. Well, I mean, you guys have a mission wait. target time. You you have you have a you know seven day week long cutoff. This yeah. is this is day number three. Uh, um, no, so this is day number four. It's three. We yeah, still have no, it's three. Days. Yeah, it's three. So okay. you guys still have four days. Yeah, it, right, it, ha yeah. it takes you place. wait to talk to him until you, uh, you a little bit. You have the timetable. Yeah, have. okay. Ugh, four days. Okay. So then I just sort of uh, sit back in one of the guy's chairs in the recliner and just sort of. Okay. Just chill for a minute. Yeah. Fair enough. So, Angmar, um, you're trying to reach out to Consuela? Yeah, I'm, like, sitting at my desk, like, I would be staring at my phone, but it's on my, my iPhone. Like, my iPhone is pulled up, like, like, would you like to call, like, Consuela? And it's like... What's the picture for Consuela? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> she looks exactly like you think she looks. Um, and oh no, um, she's got like, oh no, <laughs> she has like lingerie on and stuff, and like <laughs> you can see in the background there's a can of lemon pledge. Oh no, <laughs> oh no, and yellow rubber gloves. Yeah, yeah, but she's got she's got lingerie on, and um, she's not um, young. No, definitely you like, not. You like them? You like them experienced? Mm -hmm. Extreme experience. <laughs> it was definitely an experience. Yeah, yeah. She, she has deft cleaning hands. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna get banned. <laughs> hey, hey, listen, Brad was streaming Conan earlier at <laughs> maximum titties, so I think you're okay. <laughs> wow, you didn't play a guy and just what Dan and I did? <laughs> yeah, I didn't do it. This was Brad. Ball drop in the street. Oh, yeah, Mav and I were ball dropping all day. <laughs> Yeah, we had a running joke whenever I died today and I was naked, I would yell at them for looking. And they'd be like, I can't look! But they would post the gachi base uh, emote from me. Yeah. Oh. Uh, so I, uh, I'm like, all right. And I call her. Okay. Uh, like two rings in, you hear. Uh, 
you hear the click like click hello this is this is Consuela uh, <clears throat> hey it's uh she's got audio only on no it's uh it's uh it's you know it's it's <clears throat> the whip <clears throat> it's it's whip she says I'm at work right now. I can't talk long. Okay, that's that's fine. That's fine. Just, just, just deep. Did, did you get those jobs we talked about? I'm I'm sending information over. Okay. All right. Did you? What about the other thing? Did you know? The the picture with the triscuits. Did you send it? So you could hear like you could hear some like fumbling like on the other side. And she says Big Whip that is so wrong. <laughs> I uh I can't wait to see that picture and uh I'll do you know how much I love. Break. Oh god. Okay, good send me those triscuits. Okay, I'll let you go. Thank you. <laughs> it's like I just lean back in my chair and I'm like <laughs> whistling intensifies just <sighs> oh no <laughs> I feel violated <laughs> Consuela the Triscuit please no okay so Consuela sends over uh, I guess like <laughs> They're sort of like almost like job stat blocks. You're getting like, you know, information for um, space elevator uh, jobs. Essentially, there are um, there's there's three maintenance jobs. OK. And there is one uh, janitorial job available. Uh I thought I asked for Lance jobs. I thought she was HR for Lance. Was she Lance or was yeah. she Tesla Amazon? Oh, no, it was she was Lance. Lance. Yeah. For security. Um, that was right? the whole reason because I like we needed to get. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So hold on. My bad. How could you? Okay. So she's going to give you. Um, so she's going to give you, um, two desk jobs. Um, I guess they're like the security desk. Um, so there's two desk jobs and there is, um, I guess like three general security. It's just listed as general security. Okay. Uh, can I? What is there any other details on the desk job, like what it is? It's just a security desk. It's a security desk, and I don't, what the fuck? Oh my you? god, <laughs> Dan! <laughs> <laughs> it, so it just says security desk, and it says like. It says like the um, estimated like pay rate and the uh, the hours. Okay. So they're they're daytime hours. Um, I guess it's like an afternoon shift. Based on when we know that the lift is going to take place, uh, the event's going to take place. Do those hours match up with the lift time? Yep. Okay. And also with general security as well. Yes. Um, the times I think are slightly skewed. The general security is uh, probably like an hour beforehand. Okay. Okay. So we'll say the general security starts like 11 a.m. and the uh, desk jobs start at uh, noon. Okay. Um, <clears throat> so I. Uh, it's a nine hour shift. So I. Uh, I kind of lean forward and I kind of read that and. Uh, I lean back and I, I just say, um, <clears throat> Susan! Is 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was lounging. I got, got, I got, I got information for you. Come here. I gotta talk to All you. Right. All right. Shoot. <clears throat> okay. I got word back from my contacts. My wonderful, wonderful my contact. Um, who is? Uh, they got us three jobs, two general security positions for whoever, and a third is a desk security officer. Wow. Like I said, my contact's good. They've uh, they've worked me worked for me for quite a while. Great. Yeah. That that would be great. All right, cool. So here's the question. Mm-hmm. Who do we put where? Who gets what job? Because I have to send her the information. Well, who do you want to be in those spots? Who do you you know everybody? It'll you be, just let me know. It'll be you, Elbereth, and Kit there. Kit's going to probably be the one, based on their skills, to install the explosives. Well, why um, don't we have those two, since they're so good at working together? Why don't we just have them be the general security that patrols together? And I'll just that. be the desk. We could do that. Very good that. at desking. All right. <clears throat> we'll do that. Here are the start times, and I kind of like, I kind of like, brush over the information here's the information about the jobs in more detail here and i kind of you know brush that page or that document over to her with my iphone um okay okay. so we've got this information we've got access there they'll most likely need to show up for orientation a day early or something i'm not sure i'll get more details on that and let you know that way we can get all the credentials they can get access and they can get uniforms so they'll be in and ready to go for the actual mission time. Okay. By the way, I backed you up there about, you know, threatening to rip the spine out of my guys. And though I think that that's beautiful and you've got gusto, I, if I may impart some wisdom about dealing with my people. You, they seem fine. You can just ask them for tea. They'll get it for you. <laughs> They don't need. They don't. They're fine. Oh, they I mean, get it. That it's not life threatening. It's fine. All right. Well, uh, other than that, how's the research going? Um, good so far. Right now, uh, I'm just waiting to hear back. I've sent some of uh, the guys, your guys, out to go find a bunker. Wait, they you sent them out? Yeah. They have computers for that reason. Well, they went into the wilds to find a bunker. All right, that's like a two-day trip out there. Why don't we go ahead and grab another two and tell them to just look it up on their computer? Worst case scenario, we get two bunkers. All right. More bunkers. Siren will be thrilled. I think she would be, too. That being said... I suppose the only other thing is for you to call Angelo to talk about the explosives and getting the details on that. Well, let's find the bunker first. A bunker, or find out about where Kit and everyone's at. And then we'll call. I mean, we could have my people do it and you can call Angelo at the same time. Get stuff done. Be prepared. Okay. What do you what do you need to do still? What are you up to? As far as I know, the only thing that's left is finding finding the details to the explosives, finding the bunker, and potentially working with Siren to get our access into Teslamazon Matrix Space, who the fuck knows what it's called. But I suppose we're waiting on them for that. Other than that, we'll do what we can. It's Yep. Pretty much set up. Totally hear that. All right. Well, I will send more out to find bunkers. All right. But don't just keep them here. Right. Right. Yeah. PC, don't send. computers. Yep. You're right. Right. All right. Go, go, yeah. Good job. Okay. Okay. All right. Yeah. Right. Just not actually out, but just yeah, like no, no, out, just but like here on the computer. They yeah. Can do it. Yeah. Totally. Right. Yeah. Cool. I mean. Cool. Yeah. Um, yep. So we'll work that way. I'm gonna go. Okay. Bye. Bye.
Wow. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck was that? <laughs> I don't want to know. <laughs> <clears throat> <laughs> that was great. Say, I, I uh, on my iPhone, I send a message to Consuela, and I just say, "We'll take him." Dot dot dot. And I'll take you. <laughs> Fuck. God. Fuck. <laughs> yeah, you get a Triscuit emoji. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> I'm just like. Oh. I put one in my mouth. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Uh, You're gonna think of that every flavored. time now, Dan. Yeah, Avocado, I... cilantro, and lime flavored, yeah, baby. <laughs> That's Consuelo. <laughs> nope. No longer mine. Nope. I'm out. Stay nope. in. I gotta go third. Get wrecked, oh. nerd. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, so yeah. I think I think that you get uh you probably hear like a you probably hear like a, a a ding to indicate that you got like a new male, um, Angmar. I got and, a new male. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I uh, I open it up. Yeah, it, it's the Triscuit picture. <laughs> oh! Um. So, uh, I just I kind of like looking at this, and I'm just like. The door is sliced to ribbons. The, the door is closed. Or the, the, sorry, the door is sliced to ribbons. And all you hear from the other room is just the snap, crackle, pop of the of the whip. Oh, for fuck. <laughs> That's this, it. This is the That's darkest, it. the darkest timeline of this season. <laughs> what is that gift? <laughs> <laughs> fucking chat that sounds oh, like a move God. to me <laughs> <laughs> roll an act under pressure to control your flailing whip uh, so, there's burn marks all around the floor by oh, the way. Stop, stop. <laughs> <laughs> this is what you're gonna see tomorrow Matt just prepare yourself <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Bring yeah. some triscuits. Oh I'm I am about to just be done with the episode. Oh my god. Oh fuck. This episode's gone to shit. Oh. oh. You know what's very funny though? We've gotten so much shit done. We've gotten so Have much we? shit done on a mission, I yes. Mean, and also so. Consuela sent us Triscuit pictures. Oh, so. Yeah. so uh there's no us in that. So, uh, you get a, um, you get a, um, uh, you get one of the guys that you sent out looking for a bunker to come back, Susan. Um, and, uh, you don't oh. get the fuck, you're just going to go away. <laughs> oh, oh, no, that's it. It's probably the puppy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here. So, uh, yeah, one of one of Angmar's goons returns. Um, wait, 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 wait. The ones that she sent out, <laughs> not onto the. Yeah, yeah. What uh, the yeah. fuck? Okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so he says. Uh, um, he says. Uh, okay, uh, we found a bunker. Really? Yeah. But you, okay. Okay. Well, show me. Okay. Um, do you want me to pull it up on the computer or? Yeah, pull it up on the computer. Okay. Walks over, pulls up just like a general map of the area. Um, <laughs> yeah, there's there's like a um, th there's just like a um, he. he I want to say probably like four streets over from the warehouse. Um, he says, uh, there was a bunker from the last world war, uh, right here, you know, when they were going to drop some nukes, he says, um, there's one, it's, it's only like four blocks away. 
I mean, it's close, right? Right. Come with me. Oh, I walk no. over to Angmar and I see the whip marks. <clears throat> oh, God. <clears throat> yeah. Yes. What? What? Uh, what's up, boss? I just want to give you some information. Go ahead. Tell him what you told me. Uh, whip. Um, we found the bunker that she wanted. Good. I'll have the information. Where is it? It's only about four blocks away. It's really easy to walk to. I'm sorry. Did you say the bunker is four blocks away from here? Well, yeah. Yeah. When we're doing a mission in Boa Vista. She didn't tell us that. I thought you'd want one close. I didn't know if there was... Was the base coming under attack or anything? She didn't say. He is accurate. Did not say. You two, out. <laughs> Find a bunker close to the space elevator in Boa Vista. Well, that's not even close to this. I understand that. Do what I'm saying now. You did what she asked, even though no. she wasn't specific. Show me your computer over here while he fixes this. Sure. And then I kind of like, as they walk out, like I look at Susan and I'm just like, <laughs> I need fucking detail. Like, what? <sighs> okay. So, uh, Susan, uh, Susan, I would like you to make the research move. <laughs> there, <we go. laughs> there it is. At least he didn't actually make it through the research hole. All right, Lack. That's okay. All right. Oh. I, I can't hate on that. Research move, roll plus your mind. Oh. Ah! <laughs> what are these rolls? Poor Mav. Oh Poor Mav, God. dude. This did always take, is like the Did dunk. I take all the good rolls or something? Good yeah. Time. Oh, my God. All right. So. Yeah. Uh, the information that you're looking for uh, in regards to bunkers in the area uh, is non-existent because there are no bunkers in the area um yeah they just they they're you can't find anything in any public information on these bunkers anywhere close to the space elevator i pop my head in so he, dramatically i would yeah, think so, so um he says uh, this guy's name is Enzo. Um, he <laughs> says, uh, I, I, uh, th there aren't any bunkers in Boa Vista. There's nothing close. If there well, are, is there, is there like, is there like a building or anything that's like super isolated or alone in the area? It's, uh, it's kind of, uh, an expensive area. There's not really any any open space everything's taken they put up as much residential buildings in the area as possible it's where a lot of rich people live hmm is there anything any rentals available mansion rental it's big house uh no it's nothing boa vista is booked solid Okay. Well, that goes that idea. Thank you. And so. He just kind of shrugs his shoulders and says, sorry. Just go hang out over there and wait for the tea. And when the tea comes, will you please tell me? Okay. Thank you. She didn't threaten to rip out their spine. <laughs> you did the kid meme. So I, I walk over into Ingmar's <laughs> office. Uh, so. Yeah. 
So there's no bunker. There's nothing. There's literally nothing. All right. Well. So I guess we're, we'll have to go with. We'll have to go tell Siren. We'll have to go with the apartment. You know, I actually had one thought. Hmm. Why don't. You know, I've got people up there from Downlink. We may not have the bunker, but I might be able to increase our security from that location just as a precaution so that we have more than just myself and Siren there. <clears throat> Nobody I mean, particularly talented, but I suppose more meat shields in a way if things go a bit haywire. Mm hmm. It's a good one. You think that maybe we should look into that? I think we should. All right. <clears throat> well, why don't you go tell Siren that uh, her dreams of the bunker are maybe not yet coming true? And I'll worry about getting in contact with my people up in Boa Vista. Also, call Angelo. Make sure we figure out what's going on with the charges. We have All right, to I will call Angelo. You go see who can help you in adding bodies, but make sure that they are a little bit stealthy and can be discreet. I'll see what I can do. Discreet's not necessarily the strong point of my organization, but we have people of different talents. <clears throat> Go over to Siren. Uh, yeah, so Siren is sitting like she's back like at out. she's like sitting back at her deck and she's drinking like the cold tea. <laughs> Siren, <sighs> I've come with good and bad news. Would you like to pick? Why not start with the bad? Well, there's no bunker. Of course not. Why would there be? But. <laughs> <laughs> it's too accurate. I can't. Sorry. <laughs> it's too accurate. But we have a better solution and we're getting you more tea. Brilliant on the tea. What is your better solution? Well, if, uh, what do you think about a high security? <sighs> Hole in the wall, need to know basis location. High security, lots of protection. Angmar, even. I'm sorry, repeat that. I missed that. What was that? I said lots of security. Angmar, even. No, no, before that. Hole in the wall. What were you asking Siren to do? Oh, <laughs> I was telling her the news. Okay. Um, <laughs> I feel like there's a sentence missing that I just never got. <laughs> I wasn't telling her to do anything. Yeah. I was so, telling her about what's going on. Yeah. Um, okay. So I told her to find a, a hacker, but yeah. So she says, so... <laughs> Can't. What you're telling me is mm -hmm. that we have no bunker and you want to try and increase security? Yes, we found a place, small. Good, good. Will Extra security, access? yes. Okay, and what do you need from me? I need you to find a hacker friend. Right. Mate. Compadre. Buddy. I trust you. I mean, I picked a bad one and he's still out there, so. Oh no, I remember. I thought you might have forgot. Also, we need to find out. I have a lasting impression. We also need to find out, Siren. What? What if, if anything was disturbed or anything when you, you know, did the woo thing? <laughs> yeah. I just thought you remember when you did the 
It was it was really like, dramatic, right? It was ah! yeah, okay. She's just staring at you, like. That's what I need you to do. That's all. Is there anything you need besides tea? Find a, another hacker. Yes, go find another hacker. One that you trust. Preferably someone you want to work with or can stomach or deal with working with. I'm letting you pick. It's a big mission, big job. Well, I know some people. I'll investigate. Okay. I'm going to do what you need to do. Okay. Okay. I'm going to go. You let me know if you need anything else. Bye. <laughs> Forgot to say you're in your cupboard. Fine. We'll find a I new one. I can't call it a cupboard. It's too weird. It doesn't yeah. make sense. I don't, I can't. <laughs> All right. So I go back to the room and I'm assuming en Enzo is still standing there. No, he probably, yeah, I mean, he probably left. Like he's, he did his shit. He's gone. Okay. Um. You were trying to wait. He was trying to signal you for tea. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. That's right. Uh, is there another guy in there too? Just like walking around. Sure, there's people around. Hey, you. Just hanging out. If yeah, siren, it's a, it's if a siren woman. calls. It's a woman. She looks like um. She looks like uh the woman from uh, Aliens. Um, <laughs> oh, what's, oh, what's her name? Oh God. And she's actually a white woman too, which was crazy because she did not look white at all in that movie. Like they did tan tan paint um what the hell was her name the one with the fucking giant gun uh, no idea what you're talking about an alien aliens uh oh sigourney weaver no. no oh are you talking about the badass woman yeah that's in yeah every... the badass oh. marine revere it revere it yeah yeah oh yeah. uh oh. How do you guys not remember her? Hold on. I don't, I don't remember names. Dude, it's been like 20 She's years the since I've seen the alien. Big gun. She had the muscles and shit. She was super cool. Vasquez, that's it. Vasquez? Oh, oh Vasquez? Vasquez? Hold on. Vasquez? Yeah, she She's... had the fucking... <laughs> she had the red bandana. <laughs> oh, okay. Jeanette Vasquez. Uh, that's what you're saying. Yeah, but Jeanette Vasquez. That's what she looks like? Oh, that, that chick is tough shit. Nice. Man, yeah, she's, she's a badass fucking ripped, woman. dude. Oh, my God. Fuck yeah. She's white, that woman. The woman that actually played her, she's white. Interesting. <laughs> yeah. She was the same woman in uh, Terminator 2, the mom. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, yeah, the knife through the face, that's the same woman. Same actress. Huh. Huh. Anyway, we're uh, playing. Um, <laughs> by the way, yeah. <laughs> oh, what are you, she, what she are you up like to? That. What are you up to? She says, walking. Okay. If you hear anything from Siren, come straight to me. Like what? Please. Like Is literally anything. I am going to make a call. I want you to stand by just in case she needs anything. Very important. Your life depends on this. She crosses her arms. Uh, go ahead, give me a play hardball, please. <laughs> he threatened <Threats>. people. <laughs> Plus your edge. Hey, I got it. it. Come on, bus. Hey, oh, I'm okay. Bus. That'll work. The nine. Yes. Okay. Yes. MC chooses one. You, uh, okay. <laughs> I'm eyeing those okay. fucking clocks, man. Okay. Yeah, right. Fuck, he doesn't even tell us what he chose anymore. Fuck. Oh, God, the mystery now. He used to tell us. <laughs> you he used, used to, to tell us, Dad. <laughs> So Those were the best days. Uh, <laughs> now I'm going to be looking through and trying to find out. Okay. <laughs> oh, sorry. Yeah, she just kind of crosses her arm. She gives you like a sort of half pissed off kind of look. She just leans up against the wall. Thank you. And I turn and walk away. 
have to be right in her life. <laughs> Casually. <laughs> Thanks, sweetheart. I'm <laughs> Okay. Um, why don't we take a break here? Mm. And because uh, we're late on the break, let's take a break. Sorry. And uh, we'll come back for the next part of tonight's Neon Screen. We'll be back in just a little bit, everybody. Hang tight for a few minutes.
Welcome back, everybody, to Neon Scream, where we serve up the dead shit. <laughs> <laughs> dead Triscuits. No! Come the fuck I can't you have Triscuits. It's okay, dude. Dan's got tri-tip steak uh, tacos, man. You can't make them... There's not, unless you describe the Consuelo Triscuit scene again, right now. <laughs> <laughs> Big win. Oh, I want Big dog win. arms. It's now. Give me oh. your weedy goodness. Oh, no. Kill me. Oh, my crunch. Ah! Fucking kill me. Got him. Oh. <laughs> Nope, look at him! Out. Look at him! Look at him! Try to keep it down. Nice, nice. Wow. <laughs> and he's done. <laughs> oh man! I'm fucking crying. <laughs> My fucking cheeks hurt. <laughs> We've been la laughing so much. Welcome back, oh, everybody. Oh. I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> Big whip needs a minute. <laughs> oh no. I wish I had something super crunchy. Welcome back. Okay, so uh, I think we switched back to Kit and Elbereth um, in, the, yes. in the apartment. Yeah. Um, mm. Yeah, so you just got off the phone with Angmar um, and uh, what do you I have a question. Doing? Yeah. So I I'll possibly have an answer for you. Yeah. So I have my move. Your master at trailing people and stalking out locations when you perform surveillance on a person or place, gain intel and roll assess. I did the assess part of that move. Mm -hmm. Is that okay if I get intel? You are going to get intel on this place. Yes. On okay. The yep. That's what I was. I was clarifying that. I looked at that and was like, Fuck, just that's, just, that's ma a... just make note of it that you have an intel on, yep. uh, intel you know, on J26, I think it was. 26. Yeah, I was saying. Intel J26. Okay, cool. Um, great. Uh, you know what? While looking around while she's working, um, with that intel... I've, I'm sir, like, and you can tell me how much of this I find or how much is legible to make it maybe that way. I find uh, an old postcard from the ex boyfriend while looking around. So it wouldn't, yeah. I but mean, not it a wouldn't postcard, be a but like, postcard. So it would definitely, it would be like in the uh, slideshow, there's like an, his address or like his name. And I'm trying to find like use the intel, like the intel for like name location. Yeah, you already have the name. Oh, I do. Uh, okay, that yeah. wasn't actually said. All right. Uh, yeah, you you have the name. This was mentioned when you originally were told the um, info. Yeah, I think I've oh, got it. We've right. That's right. Yeah, uh, Katsuto it. Nakamura. There's four of them located in Boa Vista, um, and it's for Project E3 Integration. That's all we know on it. I'm writing that da that down in my notes. Yeah, mm. but you, way you, more relevant. You, you do have an address for Katsudo Nakamura. Uh, that's right. We already had that address too, didn't we? Yeah, yeah. We have all four addresses in San Francisco. Uh, or no, San Francisco, San Pedro, San Vicente, and Calunga. Okay. Um. All right. Well, I won't use that intel for that. I guess then, uh, since we already have all the info. <laughs> Thank you. Guys. Thank you. Um. Okay, I'll hold on to that until for now. Um, but I wrote that down. Um, so what I will do, though, um, I'm going to, with that picture that I sent Angmar, I'm also going to send him uh, Konsuda Nakamura, Project E3 integration, and... Uh, the four addresses that we got. Okay. okay. Oh, thank you, Jay, so much. Oh my God, you're uh -huh. my savior. You're my savior. There it is. Sally. I Stevens. found her fucking name. It was Sally Stevens. It was Sally. <laughs> it was. Sa right. Oh, it was Sally. But I, I didn't know if it was Stevens or if I named her Sally Sallerson. <laughs> 
Yeah, that's all. That's all we um, have. Of those th four cities or areas, which one is the closest to this apartment? Uh, good question. Uh, that's gonna be San Francisco. Okay, so and I would send over San Francisco is the closest location. There are four people with the same name, each one, uh, one at each address. So I give you that in a text, as well as this is the guy who tried to kill us, also the ex-boyfriend of the person we're staying with. Okay. Um... Oh my God, wait, I just got it. Did we kill all four of them? Maybe. We'll see if they're clones, we can have more. <laughs> but boy, it'd be great if we did murder all of them with, and the one that I took the soda from is their ex. <laughs> Oh my god, you sold her back her You own fucking- drugs. You killed- ah! You killed her boyfriend and then gave her drug or gave her drugs. Sold and stole her apartment. It's drugs. sold her drugs, actually. Yeah. And stole then her stole her apartment. And back to her. That's evil. I love it. Yeah. Uh, the guy who tried to kill Kid and Elbrook, what was the other rest of part of that message? That was the guy who tried to kill you. The information yeah. and uh and the ex-boyfriend of the person we're staying with. Okay. Got it. Uh, it's been like, yeah, look into possibility of all four of them being dead as we killed all four that ran into us. Could be more, could be no more. Um, and then after the could be no more, uh, a little big grinning emoji. Interesting. Okay. I just, I just send back like a, uh, like a capital O period lowercase o oh, and then followed up with k perfect <laughs> perfect uh we killed them all i hope so um okay um all right oh actually i didn't tell you that there was no bunker so I'll, nope. I'll respond back with, um, I'll respond back with, <clears throat> um, Susan looked into bunker. No, no luck. Work on securing the neighborhood and seeing what you can do to help, uh, the security of the, uh, of the apartment. Okay. Okay. Also, uh, another thing, and I say also found jobs for you and Kit and and um, Susan for Lance security to get you access to the elevator. Uh, responds with K. Okay, hope the hope the outfits are nice. <laughs> I don't say anything. Yeah. <laughs> Kid, it looks like we've got some employment. Oh, where will we yes. be working? The elevator. That's perfect. Yes. Are it we? It looks like he's. What? Are we heading there now? No, not right now. We can rest okay. a bit. Hmm. But it looks like we've got jobs with Lance Security. Which, since they do the security for the elevator, hmm. is rather convenient for you. Didn't look around and not so suspicious like. We just don't like them. No, we don't. But we like their weapons. Yes, we do. Hmm. <clears throat> when do we get these jobs? That's a good question. <laughs> As expect, when's our first day <laughs> at the job? Uh, and I said, uh, I just say TBD. But minimum, um, well, just TBD. How long do we have? Like four days. Is it four days left? Yeah. Okay. Okay. We yeah. got some time. We done some fucking work. Yeah, here. man. We did a lot of legwork. We got here. some Jeez. work. We get shit done. What is this stream? Well, should we solve this issue? Hmm. Perhaps. Her her boyfriend. We mean. Oh yes, yes, yes. That's oh yes, yeah. Maybe we should wait before she uh, when she finishes working. Mm -hmm. 
might put her in a better disposition when she gets finished with that without interruption. We understand what you're implying. Yes. <laughs> yes. Um, but should we go finish this favor for her? Yes, that's, that's what I meant. We just want more drugs to sell. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you are a smart one, you know? We could buy a lot of equipment with that. Yes, we could. <laughs> Boy, I am not on my game today. I'm glad I brought you around. We are, too. Ah. We should go get some drugs. <laughs> Were you impressed with my ability to peddle them? Absolutely. Good. You'll have to do it again. Probably will. I don't mind that so much. Hmm. Susan! Susan. Well, I don't know why Sal, I'm trying to Sal. call for Susan. Yeah. Sally! <laughs> <Even> louder. <laughs> to near you. Like a thousand times louder. Um, so yeah, you hear like, you hear like keys clacking away as yeah. uh, Sally is just kind of in the zone. She's like, busy. What do you want? Oh, oh, sorry. We were just wondering if we could help you with that favor now, or you wanted us to wait for a bit. I don't care whenever. It just has oh. to be done. Well, it's it benefits you, you know, with your whole concentration. Hmm. So it's a matter of, do you want us to go out now or wait a minute while until you're done? Whatever works. The sooner, the better, I guess. Okay. Okay, well. Get us information of where we need to go and meet up with that friend of yours. Well, isn't that like part of your job? I gave you his name and I gave you where he lives. Did we get that original name? No. Before we, the addresses before? we got the name, but we didn't get his address. We got just the name. That was it. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, we, we need the address, sweetheart. Mm. That was it. You only gave us his name. Well fine and she just kind of uh she does something like on her iphone and she just like flicks it over to you thank you that's all we'll be on our way you have a spare key that we can get in without having to bother you while you work no he took it oh that's not he nice changed the code on me too oh that sucks what was the old code why does that matter? What was the old code? The code for his door was 31495. Thank you. And I meant, I'm sorry, I meant your apartment. An extra key for here. She said oh. he took it. No, I thought you were talking about his place. I oh. know, I'm sorry I wasn't clear. Hang on, let me see if I can find it. He might have it still, now that I think about wait. Oh, well, that's fucked then. <laughs> oh, dice roll. Oh, no. <laughs> mm, sorry, he still got it. Okay. <laughs> No access code or anything, just a physical swipe. Well, I mean, you saw the buzzer downstairs. I mean, I can give you that code. That would be helpful. We don't have to bother you when we come in then, at least. It's fine. I'll just change it after we're done. Thank you. So she says um, it's 9632. Thank, Thank you. you very much. We'll be on our way, and we're going to go see if we can take care of that problem for you. Um, We would like to do something real quick. Oh. Still did not spend uh, that hold that I had from the covert entry. That's because you weren't alone. Uh, can I... Oh, I guess we can't use it now. Fuck. <laughs> Damn it. Okay. All right. All right. Wasted. Tempted to tell Helper at the fuck off for a minute. <laughs> no.
No, I don't think it really no, no. works like that. Yeah, no. It's, it's you guys have, have passed. We've been here a while. On that. Um, okay. Okay. Um, before I leave the apartment, um, because I still have one hold on my assess here. In regard to the apartment, oh God, mm. okay, for for hacking specifically, what potential complication do I need to be wary of that I can tell Siren ahead of time? Like, internet acts, any of that stuff. Like, what would be a potential complication Siren's going to run into? Here? So, since this is a rich place. Um, I think you can see that the security on this place seems kind of legit. Um, they definitely have some security guards that you guys did not see on the first entry into this place. Um, and, uh, they have some kind of, like, security protocol on their network. It's probably one of those things where, like, you know when you have, like, an ADT alarm or whatever for oh, your yeah. house? They'll have like a fucking, this house is protected by ADT. You'll have some kind of shit that's pasted up for the security. Right. Um, and we'll say that um, Lance is paramilitary. Who would be appropriate for this? Let's see. This the is. Rent a cop place. I? AYE? Aren't uh, they the. the yeah, this v. is going to be AYE. Yep. I just know them as the camera guys. <laughs> that's. Yep. Yeah. It, okay, cool. It, it's AYE like um uh AYE network security or some shit like that. Um Okay. All right. Uh what I'd like to do, I'm going to text Siren that that information right now. Uh and I've got it written down too so I can tell her in person next session. Uh Heads up, potential complication at our lo uh, at our holdout for you. Security is legit. It's protocols by AYE. Um, can I use that intel to uh, like because everything was strewn about and horrible? Uh, would I be able to have found potentially some access codes on like a thumb drive just sitting around? If she's that distracted. Um, so I think like what her you, login info basically into the network. I, I think you could definitely find her login info. Yes. Okay. Definitely. Definitely like her, uh, her sort of like, she probably is one of those people that like writes it down on a post-it note and she's got yeah. it like stuck somewhere like in the yeah. apartment. Yeah. And I just happened to find that. Yep. Um, okay. Uh, and so I say, here's the login info for the resident in this apartment. Just get back. Great. Thanks. Yep. All right. I removed my intel. That is it. Okay. Hopefully that'll make it so she won't have uh, really horrible complications. Maybe just minor ones. Um, okay. <laughs> okay, cool. Um, and then I used up my hold. Okay. I'm just making sure I delete what I have. Okay, cool. Uh, well, should we, uh, should we go, Kit? Yeah, we I think, think so. It's yeah. it's funny just kind of seeing your guys' mm. reactions because a lot of times you guys roll so badly on critical things that, like, you're usually panicking at this point, but, like, things are kind of going your way. So yeah. you all, like, don't really know it's, how to react. It's yeah. really <laughs> weird. <laughs> yeah. I, I had that thought earlier. Like, I, I don't know what to do with good rolls. <laughs> like, yeah, cool. like, uh, I want the we login info. a reactionary yeah. team of just, like, everything sucks. So yeah. Yeah. Right now, it's kind of just, like, it's hey. Almost like, it's almost like having a soldier that's giving you a plus one forward on, like, Everything is a really good. Oh, damn thing. it! I haven't used those at all. Oh my god, I have fucked up so many rolls because of that. No. Oh, well, so much could have right. been done. Yeah, so we hit out. We fuck off. 
um, and go to the first address that we were given, uh, the Sao Francisco, Francis. The one that was closest, was that the same one that, that Sally gave us? Yes, it is. Okay. Okay. So, Let's go the get some first drugs. address that you get um, in the South Francisco area is pretty close to Centro, um, where the space elevator is located. Okay. Uh, the area is just jam-packed with housing and stuff. Um, and... It's it's funny because, like, I'm looking at the area, like, on Google Maps, and I'm trying to picture what it's like in this sort of cyberpunk dystopian future because it's very much right now, like, a sort of fenced-off suburb housing kind of almost looks like Miami kind of place. Um, I think now it's a lot of... Uh, sort of fancy apartment complexes and stuff like that um it's no more like individual kind of housing they've they've definitely had to beef up all their residential areas for more tax revenue and just because they need it um so this is still kind of the rich area here uh the area around the space elevator in general is expensive um so there's a lot of flying cars there's a lot of skyscraper uh, residences and such. Um, you see probably a shit ton of, like, carry-out, like, you know, um, uh, kind of, like, takeout places uh, zipping around. Um, there's definitely, like, a lot of food deliveries, like drones just flying through the air, obviously carrying food and shit um, to, to different people. And... Um, it's uh it's very busy i think by the time you guys get out of there um i forget what time we were at i think it was still the daytime yeah i think so yeah i think we were around like three when we went into that yeah. for emergency so we'll, say, so we'll say it's probably maybe five o'clock now or so by the time you guys are are mm. making your way out right um say so to do all that stuff probably took mm. you a few hours about 5 p.m still on yeah. the third day okay. here man we are killing it. At least I um, hope so. Yeah, Not right? Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> well, um, why don't you... That's it, right? Yeah. So this mm -hmm. building that you're we looking so. at is um, a lot different than the other one. Uh, this one is much more of a sort of... Uh, sort of traditional like looking residential area it's like a straight up and down kind of skyscraper right it's like a big rectangle um and the um uh the bottom floor there's probably like a decent amount of people sort of returning from work hmm. um you know it's kind of rush hour now um so it's it's jam-packed there's a lot of people moving about it's very crowded um lots of I think just kind of like people in suits and shit. You're seeing rich people moving about. Yeah. Uh, on this ground floor, you're seeing a lot of, um, uh, I guess there's just a lot of people like walking on the street. Okay. Okay. Up um, above, you, there's lots of flying cars and shit. They probably have like a mid level parking garage in this place. Oh. Nice. God. <laughs> Sorry. Um. Pretty nice. We. We can take a look. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Good. I'll do the we same, all... but I'll take a different angle. Um. Just gonna stare around, intimidated by all of this. We're going to. Um. Case a joint real quick. Um. Roll edge. Try and find some exploits in uh, the building. For us to get into so how do you do this i i want to know how you're sort of handling this when you try to case the joint so um is there is there like a concierge uh of any kind inside at Definitely. all yeah yeah okay so it would be if if there's any windows looking in looking at like the the um just taking an hour even maybe maybe two looking at when they go to do their um their scheduled walkabouts uh if they do any um what what 
people do to get inside to the building, uh, if there's currently any maintenance crews around, um, what the um, the maintenance area around the back is, because most places usually have a loading dock. So any okay. any any kind of um, way to slip in, a lock that could be busted or or needs to be busted on the side of a building, et cetera, et cetera. Okay. Um, so you're not going in. You're just kind of looking around the outside. Yeah. This is this is just um, taking a quick peek. I mean, we'll even we'll even see if we can just walk in to the to the foyer, um, or if we get stopped or something. Um, yeah, you would definitely get stopped <laughs> if you try to get past like the the front desk. Okay. Okay. That's perfect. Um, yeah. We would just turn around and walk back out then. All right. So go ahead and give me plus your edge for your case the joint. And plus this is one point. forward because of Susan. Uh, did you fail before? It, Have well, I failed okay. so far? Is yeah. it an outright fail or a partial success? Which one? I think it's an outright fail. I don't. <laughs> I mean, chat's going to have to. Oh, uh, I mean, I just outright failed on. Oh, no. Well. No, that well, that was a six on the edge roll. Um, if you scroll yeah, up, that's a fail. I, okay, so that's your bonus. would have been no a more. seven with the plus one though. <laughs> but yeah, you didn't get the how far back do we want to go? <laughs> All right. Um, Ouch! Oh, Damn! God! Damn! Damn! You soaked up all the bus. <laughs> all right. Well. Mm. Okay, so your case the joint does not lead to much information, primarily because you don't get past the front desk. Yeah. Um, your just general reaction has you you get you get that kind of like help you, you know, kind of thing. Like mm. as soon as you try to like walk past and you just like turn around and walked out. Mm. Um and uh they've definitely like kept their guard up in regards to you. Like that's mm -hmm. a that's a red flag for a security guy. Somebody like doesn't answer them and they just kind of like walk out. Yeah. Don't say anything. That's mm -hmm. a red flag. Um, the the uh, so you're when you try to like go out and just try to case joint and trying to be subtle about it, you don't really notice anything. There's not really a lot of openings here on from your perspective hmm. in terms of like trying to get through the security. There okay. was the security desk. It didn't seem like there was any kind of ground floor level uh access beyond that how many just guards the front door. just one um, at the at the security desk hmm. we saw one person behind the desk and there was one person by the elevator okay okay yeah we'll we'll just go find Elbereth and um if he's if he's anywhere about yeah i was probably just sitting on a bench okay watching. cool we just walk up and sit down and we can't get in you'll have to talk your way in there's two guards uh. Right. Okay. Um, that's not a problem. Hmm. I'll just have to think of how I want to attack it. You could act like you're a friend and say that you knew his old passcode. I could do that. You're I visiting do... from America, perhaps? Uh, that's fair. I did spend a little bit of time. Uh, in old Missouri, hmm. I think. And you just maybe don't know the passcode because it's been so long since you've seen him? Yes, I could do that. I could mm. also say I'm looking to live here. I have some credits I could flash and not spend, God no. But at least that see, works. and then I can get a general lay of the land. I like your idea, though, old friend. The problem... Uh, the problem would be if he was one of those that dealt his business outside of his home or in. Because if it's in, then he, they might be used to people going in and out. Hmm. Might just have to say his name, and that's enough. We'll see. Maybe All the right. guard would remember the the girlfriend. Mm, that might be a point of contention if he does. Hmm. I'll use it if I have to. Okay, we'll wait. That's a good point. Keep an eye out here. Maybe take a peek. Uh, see if uh, you can see. I don't know. Any of the guy who stabbed us going in or out. Okay. 
All right. I don't usually like talking to people if I don't have to, but I will. Hmm. Because I have to. Not your fault. That's not a slight on you. Okay. <sighs> and I get up and, and walk inside. Uh, and I attempt, I just, I just go straight for the elevator like I know what I'm doing. Uh, excuse me? Yes, sir! You need to sign in. Oh, I need to sign in! Oh, sorry! And I walk over, um, and, uh... What do I... Uh, sorry, I haven't used this particular sign-in system. Recently, at least. And I look at it, what is it, Joe? Um, yeah, so it's a screen that's got, like, a thumbprint, um, and a retinal scan. And, um, it's, it's basically, like, visitor, um, like, visitor access... And you can see like systems by AYE. Gotcha. Okay. Um, so, and I point at my eye. Slight problem with at least half of this. It's not gonna work anymore. I got into a bit of a tiff recently. What should I do about that? You have two eyes. Yeah, I know, but the retinal, like the retinas aren't the same in both. It might not read correct. He said the system should compensate. It should? Oh. Okay. Is it not gonna it's not gonna do anything to the other one aside from scan it right? I'm a little testy since the loss of this one. No. Oh. Oh good. I'm glad to hear it. I'm sorry, I'm I'm just I'm nervous. I don't like not having depth perception anymore, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you just get a new one? Well, it, it was very recent. I will. Like very recent, like yesterday. If to schedule appointments normally. Just kind of nods his head. Um he's like security goon B, right? Like this guy is just like built like a fucking like a meat like a meat house. Like this guy is just he's just fucking he's layers of meat. This <laughs> yeah. dude. Um he's got like a crew cut. Sure. Uh, so before I scan, I go, listen, I'm looking for a little discretion. I'm off to visit. Uh, what was his, what was Nakamura's room, by the way? Uh, so Nakamura oh. is going to be on one of the sub penthouse levels. He's going to have Good God. Uh, sub penthouse three. <laughs> Let's just move yeah. in there, man. This oh, free apartment. Fuck. Yeah. <laughs> hey, you've probably heard of Nakamura. So he just kind of like looks up at you and says, Mr. Nakamura? Yes. Hey, uh... Of course I know Mr. Mr. Nakamura. Hey, Nakamura, yes. I had a previous engagement with him, and uh, I'm sure you know he likes discretion. He's just staring at you. Signing in isn't usually what his clientele likes to do. Not my problem. You, I, I'll happily take an escort. I'm not going to go in or anything. I just need to knock, see if he's home. If he's not for our appointment, I'll leave. Uh, please roll your fast talk. You got All right. this. You fucking got and this. And I will uh, take a forward from Susan. Yes. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Boss. Uh, it's a seven, eight, nine. Boss, that is bad, but you're best. <laughs> Just like, yeah, oh, no. uh, what do you do? You know, what do you do? Welcome to Neon Zabibba. <laughs> um, NPCs do it, but someone will find out. The MC will advance the appropriate countdown clock. For PCs, choose one. Stop your boo. It doesn't matter. And Not great. Yeah. So uh, he says. I can escort you, but I will 
let Mr. Nakamura know that you're going to come up. I will contact him now. Okay, sounds good. And you just hear like, Mr. Nakamura? Yes. Yes, sir. Oh. Mr. Nakamura, this is the front desk. Uh, I have a, and he looks towards you. Vang. I have a Vang here to see you, sir. I can send you the feed. Yes, sir. Oh, no. No, I don't, sir. Very well, sir. I'll send him up. <laughs> Mr. Nakamura said you can go up. Wonderful. I'm glad to hear that. I know. <laughs> okay. Will you show me to his room if it need that escort still? Or are you just sending me up? He says, uh, I'll give you access on the elevator right now. Ah, thank you very much. Um, okay. And then I, uh, go up the elevator. Oh, God. Not like this. Monka fucking S. <laughs> so, uh... The elevator obviously has some kind of lock to access the sub penthouses. Mm -hmm. um, when the door opens, you have uh, basically doors almost right in front of you for the various uh, penthouses. They branch off into three um, for the penthouses. Um, the uh, you can see that there's that there's just they just kind of branch off like almost five steps out of the elevator. Um, and there's a, there's a penthouse, a sub penthouse three door. Um, the hallway in general is probably like, it looks like a fancy hotel hallway. Um, but more modern. I think it's like one of the more modern kind of hotels, maybe like one of the ones from Dubai or some shit, right? Like mm -hmm. some really, some really expensive looking shit. Right. That's not where I'm going specifically to the crazy expensive. It's the moderately expensive. No, this is expensive. Oh. This, this, I mean, a sub penthouse. Fair enough. Giant it had building. sub in the name, so I wasn't yeah. sure what yeah. that meant in cyberpunk. <laughs> yeah. It's like it's like a two bedroom apartment. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, no, these are expensive. Okay, cool. Um. Okay, so I'm. I'll let, I, I'm, at, I'm gonna ask a clarification on my eye for detail. So it's the, the whole, if you're trailing or stalking at a location, perform surveillance uh, on a person or place, you gain intel and then roll assess. Would I, would that be something where I do that like as I go, If I, or would that be something different compared to just his penthouse suite or is it the whole shebang? Would I be basically doing one or two? So I feel like there's a few answers to this question. Great. Um, primarily, you have to perform surveillance, right? Right. And I think the way that perform surveillance is read in my head mm -hmm. is that you have to observe something for a, either a period of time, like a, a decent period of time, right? You're trying to find out multiple things. Yeah, absolutely. Um, and or a a look around the specific thing that you want to surveil. Right. Okay. No, totally fair. Um, so like for me, like not dragging my feet or stopping, but walking, like going in the elevator and kind of walking slowly toward his place. That's not performing surveillance so much. No. Okay. Definitely not. Okay. No, that's totally fair. Um, yeah, surveillance. I, I think surveillance in this case would either be like direct uh observation or you trying to map a routine you know what i mean right yeah yeah just sitting for like yeah okay all right um like going through the apartment we had time so i was able to basically scope everything out look through every little bit here and there that made sense okay cool 
Um, I'd still like to, as I come in, I or like get out of the elevator, like to perform an assess role, just a standard. Sure. Um, figuring out what's going on. Uh, I'll do that. Uh, Susan, you are helping me out. Thank you. And, Yay. Uh, five, six, seven, eight. All right. I'll, the part okay, On your Thank assess, you. you get the one hold. Okay. Uh, best way in, out, past. Um, as in, like, aside from the elevator, is there, like, an access route or, like, an access, sta access stairwell, anything if I need to book it out? There is a stairwell, yes. Okay, so I catch That's that. That's pretty much the only other thing that you see in the hallway. Okay. Totally fair. Um, standard fancy-ass hallway. All right. Um, so I throw a text to Angmar real quick, just stating... Nakamura has a penthouse. This is the co correct location. Uh, the four we killed were probably clones of this guy. I'm going to go try to fucking talk to him. Maybe I'll be dead if I am. Uh, find a way to contact Kit. Staying at Sally's apartment. Uh, <laughs> I just, I respond with, I just respond with, don't die. <laughs> Don't die. Yep. Uh, so that's uh, that is what I uh, I send. So I I go up to the door. Uh, probably a doorbell or is there like a intercom buzzer? Um, there's a there's, yeah. I, I it's probably some kind of integrated security system. Like it's, um, there's some kind of like camera and yeah that's kind of what i was hoping for um all right so i hit that little buzzer like i'm, I'm aside from the door i'm not trying to like stand right in front of the door because that seems like a stupid ass idea so i'm like in front of the get calm like hit the buzzer does it like one of those like doorbell and then he has to turn it on or it automatically goes so when you hit the doorbell the door opens and behind the door you see a stunningly beautiful woman. And she says, Hi, my name is Elena. <laughs> ah, hello, Elena. And that's where we're gonna Fuck you, Whack. Today. Fuck oh, you, man. No! You know what? You know what, Whack? I'm bringing Boom Boom back. Fuck you. <laughs> He's coming back. <laughs> In an alternate universe. Oh, fucking Elena. God damn, Elena. Oh, I need one of those. I mean, uh, that's Angmar disgusting. Goes for that is. <laughs> yeah, that's that's. Yeah, Goobers or Angmar. <laughs> just gonna eat some Triscuits. Fuck it. <laughs> Fucking always Elena, man. God damn it. It's always true. Elena. It's always been it's Elena. True. The entire uh, everything is run by Elena at this point. <laughs> I don't yeah, that's it. that's the truth of it all. There's a secret organization that runs all of the organizations, and it's run by an Elena. <laughs> yeah, and the, that organization is called Elena. <laughs> Elena <body. laughs> yeah. yes. it's fuck, man. Oh my god! Oh. I was Thanks out. for DMing, Wack. Thank, Thank you. you. That was yeah. a good session. Oh man. So. Hmm. Uh, yeah. So let's go around the room. Let's uh, do some shout outs and wrap things up. Mm. Let's start with Little John. <laughs> what? Oh, yeah. Hold on. I actually yeah! have the one second. I have the. Yeah. You guys can't hear it, but the stream can. What? <laughs> okay. All right. Sorry, I'm just. I'm, I have little John all over my soundboard. <laughs> of course you do. Okay. Of course. Yeah, it's just what? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Mav. Me. Hi, I'm Mav. I go by the Mav Show on the internet, literally everywhere. The Mav Show. Well, I have show. Uh, I hang out, play games, lots of different types of games, and I uh, stream daily. So come say hi if you want to have some fun. Yeah. Yee. Yee. Goobers. Hi. Uh, apparently, I am the French Goobers. Goobers. Or actually, <laughs> it's just the Goober. Goobers. Uh, Goober. Goober. Um. Well, it's it's another possible name for your community, the Goo Bears. The Goo Bear. Mm. No. No. I mean, listen, they're gonna call themselves whatever the hell they call themselves. They tried to raise money for me to buy a cake. 
the other night for four hours. So I listen, I don't control shit. Anyway, uh, hi. Uh, <laughs> my name is Goober515, Variety Caster. Uh, I say Variety Caster, but right now I am a Battletech streamer. That being said, I do all sorts of other stuff as well. Uh, all of the all of the casts in which I am streaming on my channel, just me. That is uh, that is very much BattleTech right now. I did a an art piece recently. Almost finished it. Got pretty close for uh, for the devs of BattleTech because I know those guys. Uh, and uh, yeah, so I'm pretty obsessed with that. I play Angmar, who is Mr. Edgelord and lover of the Trisket Queen Consuela. Oh my uh, god. And uh, you will forever now taste Consuela on all of your Triscuits. You're welcome. Okay. Uh, so, uh, if you enjoy the nonsense that I have just filled your brain with, uh, please follow me at Goober715 on Twitch, Twitter, and I've actually been recently using Instagram more. So do that. Yeah. yeah. Eat your gram. <clears throat> Eat your gram. That's where I'm putting all my art. So there you go. Domestic <laughs> Dan. Hi, I'm Domestic Dan. I play. Angmar Bang. Uh, Angmar Bang. Angmar. Angmar Bang. The ultimate ship. OTP. Threw me up. Uh, they little both known love fact, biscuits. my real name is Angmar, and I just wanted to change it early on. No, uh, I, I play Elbereth Bang on uh, Neon Scream, and uh, yeah, I am making really dumb choices right now, but it, I just want this interaction because it sounds hilarious and dead. wonderful. You are uh, dead. Very possibly. Maybe not. Who knows? We'll find out next episode. Uh, I do gaming cast uh, cooking streams, gardening streams. Uh, right after this stream, I'm going to play more Boy of Dad um, because it's a great game, Bron. Boy. 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 Hi. Well, I'm the person this channel's being hosted on. Um, every other day, we uh, play sometimes video games and also host Coffee Time. Um, tomorrow, we're playing Conan Exiles. I'm going to try and get Dan and Goobs in on this soon. Oh, what time? Um, Late? Early. Uh, I mean, I could play. Early? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I'm I'm streaming early. Yeah, yeah. Tell but, me, because I'm, I'm cooking. Yeah, some, I need, oh, I need you know, times, because I little. got plans, but I could be, yeah, just I'll I'll give boy, some, let me know. Boy, yeah. Dan, start, start a group DM <clears> so, on Discord, go! Dick Simulator is a game that I'll be playing for the next couple of uh, days, and <laughs> um, make sure to check out our other Table Story shows. Uh, Wax got a special announcement over on his stream tomorrow, twitch.tv slash Wax Steven. Make sure to go Dude, follow go everybody, um, everybody on the cast, please. And um, he also does two shows on the weekends. Basically, they're the Wax Weekends. No one else has a show the on the weekend. The Wack -in. I was thinking the Wack -in. <laughs> so Go watch Wack on the weekends. Uh, Monday on Brad's channel, we got the Nameless Ones and uh, Dust Veil as well. And uh, Table Story Ilios will be coming back for three episodes in about two to three weeks from now before we start our new campaign. So thanks for watching, everyone. And um, we'll see you guys next Friday, right? We don't have any cancellations or anything, right? We're good? I don't think so. Okay, I, I wanted to make sure. See you guys next Friday, 7 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time. And don't forget to go sub to the YouTube. Bye! Bye. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> gonna do our parade with. Elbow, elbow, wrist, wrist. Elbow, elbow, wrist, wrist. Oh, right. It's the, it's the. Elbow, elbow, wrist, wrist. Yeah, but...